Konnichiwa. Konnichiwa, everyone. Good morning. Good afternoon. Good evening. <laughs> Konnichiwa. Josuiji Shinri from All the Stars English Guild Tempest. Good to see you all. Konnichiwa. Oh, it's good to see everyone again. <laughs> uh, all right, Chad, real quick. Um, I haven't been getting much sleep today, so I'm kind of like sleepy and tired. Here, let me shuffle over a little bit. Do this to get some empty space there. <clears throat> I haven't been getting that much sleep recently. This is just a lot of work. <laughs> uh, sleep loss slime, yeah. I think, um, are you okay? Are you going to be okay with little sleep? I should be fine. Um, it's mostly just like everything, like taking off and just hitting the ground running and that's all. Really. Small hearted, thank you for using my art as your thumbnail. No, thank you for drawing it. It is really cute. Thank you so much for the super chat. And thank you so much for the art as well. Really appreciate it. I, oh my gosh. I love RPG Maker Horror Games and I'm trying my best not to like stuff my schedule full of those. I want to keep it a little bit uh, spaced out so I don't burn out everyone on the on the RPG Maker Horrors. <laughs> uh, no mad father, just tired father. Yeah, I, I do feel tired. I don't know if you can like hear it in my in my like voice right now, but. I don't know, I think for me, uh, I love to see the hearts, love seeing the hearts. <laughs> mm. I think for me, I am... Okay, chat, let me tell you a little bit. Uh, while we wait just a bit, uh, for everyone to kind of trickle in, let me tell you what I hope to do in in the future. I don't know if this is going to be... This, is gonna, um, this might take a while because of just how long it's going to take to get all the permissions and everything, but what I hope to do is at some point build up a nice little repertoire of uh, games, a nice little portfolio of games, and have that be something that I can like edit down into smarter, smaller videos. Edit down into smaller videos. I think I mentioned this briefly uh, a little while back. Um, so right now I'm kind of like burning through most of the horror games that we do have permissions for in order to be able to like cover those. Like I say cover in the same way like someone would cover a cover song, but like cover them and like play through them, uh, play through the games uh, in the same way that someone would play through or play through the games in the same way that someone would cover a song. <laughs> Something like that. Which is why I kind of want to like push myself really hard to like get as much videos out there as possible. <laughs> yeah. Ah, <laughs> oh, sorry, chat. My nose is a little stuffy. I can already feel it. It's gonna get pretty, uh, pretty stuffy, pretty bad. Later. <laughs> Condensed stream videos, something like that. Yeah. Hello, Milk Plus. Thank you so much for the super chat. Good morning, Shinri. What piece of horror, media horror, sparked your love for the genre? I love Curse of the Cowardly Dog growing up. I don't know if I can pick out like a very specific one thing. Mm. Mm. If I had to pick like one, just one, that would probably be... The Mummy? I think... Like the like the the late twentieth century hit film The Mummy featuring Brendan Fraser. And like that's probably like the one they like I don't I don't I don't really remember. It was a long time ago. Like I've been um I've been like yeah, <laughs> does it count as horror? I think so. It like it doesn't take itself too seriously, but like there are some spooky moments and the spooky moments I think are very good. <laughs> Um, yeah, like, that's probably the one I don't really know. I don't, um, I don't keep track, or I did not keep track back in the past, so. <laughs> right, with Brendan Fraser. It was such a good movie. I missed the franchise, yeah, same here. I don't know, um, 
the later ones went off on like a bit of a tangent that was a little bit difficult for me to follow but I, it was all right i guess i think they had a plan to like redo everything um like go back and like create uh the mummy quote unquote movie for like every single culture but i i don't think i think they stopped after the last one <laughs> yeah i've been watching mummies it's scary there was a mummy cartoon that was pretty good from what i hear remember are you talking about like the mummy adaptation cartoon or like mummies alive which is like a very old it's like a, a much older like late 1990s like TV show of like mummies that like do radical stuff. But that was a long time ago. <laughs> the childhood rain. <laughs> there's a couple there's a couple of like mummy uh, like movies and like like blah, 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 TV shows and movies and stuff like that. But yeah, Mummies Alive was like I mean, remember what okay, so here's the thing, like I I I like watching them because they all have like superpowers and like they all have their like own individual powers, which is probably why I like like X-Men the most. Um, but like it was really cool just to be like, I'm a unique person and here's how I can manifest that uniqueness into my superpower and like you like take time to like try to understand it and like X-Men explores that a little bit and I don't know, it's it's silly. <laughs> <clears throat> Oh, sorry, that's not gonna help. Oh. Oh. The cast is hot. Yeah, uh, the entire cast of The Mummy is hot. I, I agree with that one. 100% agree. <laughs> I have coffee, but like, it doesn't hit the back of my sinus. I like the back of my nose. Hmm. <sighs> All right. <clears throat> God, they guys are in the desert. <laughs> Even the mummy. Okay, yeah, I agree. Even the mummy. I feel bad, but I like don't remember any of the actors besides ben Brendan Fraser. Um, but like they're all pretty. They're all pretty great. All right, chat. Ten minutes has passed, so we will be switching over to the gaming scene in which. Should be set up. Keyword being should. Should doing a lot of lifting there. Oh. There we go. Yes, cinema, and thank you so much for the super chat. All my love to Brazil to you. I can hear one obrigada. Please. Obrigada? Is that how you say it? <laughs> thank you so much for the super chat. Thank you, thank you. All right, chat, let me know if the volume is too quiet or too loud. Um, fortunately, Madfather is one of those games where uh, if you like tab away, it like. Huh, that's very quiet and I don't know why it's not playing. Hmm. Give me just a moment. The only case that I have. <laughs> oh, that's right. I shuffled over a little bit on the side um, during the the chatting portions that's not portion so chat i don't know why but you guys are not loading very well sometimes you're like stuttering on my end and i can't see the updates Drukey, thank you so much for the super chat looking forward to today's stream love mad father yeah it's one of my favorites okay i think it's a little soft on the the sound effects Like that? I think that's about good. Is that good, chat? can raise the volume a little bit more on the background. It's a little loud, though, I think. Sounds good. Okay, okay. I'll leave it back at 25. All right, chat. We're going to try to aim for the, the true ending. I have no idea how that's going to go on, though, because I don't remember... I don't remember where all the gems are, so we'll we'll see how we'll see how I'm able to manage it. <clears throat> oh, it's such a nice background music. It's so good. There's something about it, chat. I don't know why. There's something about it. Yes. Let's head into it. 
select the scenario. Normal. And we're gonna start from the prologue. Because you want all the lore. Any trigger warnings? Um there's some blood, some I think one of the characters is missing an eyeball. Uh well and there's like there's some there's some death and violence. <laughs> Alright, let's go for the lore. <clears throat> oh wait, hold up. I forgot to tweet it out. Oh no, I'm so sorry. Thank you for the reminder. Uh I'm still getting the hang of that. Because it's because I can't schedule it. Like I can't schedule a quote retweet of can't schedule a quote retweet of a chain re chain tweet. So I can't like have it all but spready and set up. Alright, chat. We start from the beginning because we need to get the lore. Here we go. This game contains scenes and imagery that some people. <laughs> it's really fast. Oh no, it's gone already. <laughs> Ooh. I love this music so much. The mountain in South Skits of Germany. Davis. Father. Father, are you in there? <gasps> Father. I, uh, how many times have I told you not to come down here? Sorry, Father. But, um... I'm too scared to sleep on my own. Don't worry. You're never alone. Your late mother is always there at your side. She's always watching over you, Aya. Okay? Please, get to bed. Yes, father. Good girl. Father, tomorrow's... Yes, the anniversary of her death. We'll visit her grave together. Okay. Now, back to bed, please. I'll be resting too shortly. Yes, Father. Ooh. Stop, stop! No! Ah! Uh, help me! Help! Ooh. I 
you know father's secrets. My father is a scientist. He loves research and is always locked up in the lab, a basement. And I've always heard things from that lab. Long and human screams. Even at a young age, I knew what my father was doing. So, and then I wasn't looking. I didn't know or hear anything. I feigned, I feigned ignorance the whole time. So I loved father. It's not the only secret I know. When mom and I weren't around, he and his helper... He and his helper what? A fine sample. I'll dispose of the remaining materials myself. I can wait. Come, Maria. Doctor. Oh. Doctor. The mistress is aware of our relationship. Mm hmm? What does that matter? I don't believe she's fond of me. That's the problem. The girl will be 11 soon. It's a troublesome age, to be sure. Be kind to her, please. Ensure that she never comes to harm. She shall always be my most precious. Scariest thing the NTR. Oh my gosh. Also, thank you so much for the super chats. I'll read them after the stream is done. Thank you, thank you. It's midnight. Today's the day mom went to heaven. Mom. Oh. Now that I'm thinking about mom, I can't get back to sleep. Okay, so that's and you your favorite doll. I don't know about that one. The doll I got from father. It's old and worn. Ooh. I brought you a present, Aya. Okay, it's a doll. Thank you, Father. Mm. This one doesn't have cracks in it, so the crack must have like gotten through, right? Like, over use? Wear and tear? What a pretty doll. It's almost like it's alive. Almost like it's alive, huh? <laughs> the plain dresser. The red-eyed stranger. Oh. Huh? Something fell out. What's this? Got gem. Nice. Gems are hidden in various places. Some require doing special events to get. You can see your gem counts in the menu. Find them all and something in it. 20 gems. Horus the traitor. It's too dark to see a thing. I don't think I could fall asleep. The portrait of mom. Mom. What should I do, mom? I do love father, but... She scares me. She's always looking at me with those eyes. I'm guessing Aya's talking about, um... Maria? I hate her. I know father likes her. Yeah, she's definitely talking about Maria. If father and her got married, I guess she would be my new mom. I don't want her to be my mom. I don't need a new mom. There's only one mom in the world for me. Why did you have to go? Oh. Very sad. Yeah, the mom is very pretty. Hello. Snowball, the pet rabbit. 
Ow. Ooh. The room feels cold all of a sudden. I'm kind of scared. I should get back to bed. Wait, I want to snowball sleeping soundly. Aw, cute, cute, cute. I should go to bed. Good night. Mm. Oh, another flashback. You sing so well, Aya. I've always thought like this song that Aya hums was like very similar to Green Sleeves, but it's not quite the same, but it's very similar. It has like a motif in it, you know. Can I turn around now, father? Just a moment. Just put this here. Yes, it's finished. A flower crown. Oh, a little twirl. <laughs> it's on her head. It's on the sprite. Ah, oh, very cute. Does it look good on me? Yes. I think it suits you well. Yay. Thank you, Father. Oh. Sorry I can't always play with you. Father. It's all right. I'm glad we could finally play today, Father. Oh my, how unusual. You two are playing? Mom! Look, Father made me a flower crown. It's wonderful. It looks great on you, Aya. So, you play with him all day? Yeah. We should do this again, Father. Yes, we should. Next time your mother should join in. No, well, I look forward to it. Mom! I, I'm sorry, it's just another fit. Hack, wheeze. <laughs> Don't push yourself if you're not feeling well. Come, get some medicine from Maria. It should help you get better. No, I can get that myself. Mom, are you hurt? You're okay, right? Sorry to worry you. Perfectly fine. Don't look so anxious, please. I am. Your smile keeps me going best, after all. If I can't see you smiling, it only makes me worry. Mom. Oh. oh. Okay. Now, let's get back for dinner. I made sirloin steak tonight. Your favorite, I am. Oh, steak? I thought... Will they have, like, a... Will they have help? Hooray, I love mom's steak. Right, father? <laughs> of course. She makes the best steaks in the world. Ha ha ha, hearty chuckle from the family. <gasps> Ooh. That's a very cute, like, family. We were so happy then. There was Maria too, but... Even so, the three of us were a happy family. But then... Mom passed away from illness. All that happiness we had just... Oh. We never really find out what illness the mom had, right? What? That scream. Could that have been father? Something must have happened. I'll go check on father. Snowball is sleeping. Let's not wake up. Let's not wake up, Snowball. I have a bad feeling. Ooh. What? <laughs> Ooh. No, don't. This way. Who's that? Come, this way. Is there somebody there? Huh? 
who are you? This way. But who are you? Stay with me. I, come on, come on, boy. An answer the question. Who are you? I said, this way. <gasps> Ooh. No. <laughs> Ooh. I wonder why he's missing an eye. Who's that? Many interesting books in this room here. Do you like books, my dear? Who are you? Oh, no need to be so wary. I'm merely a salesman. Salesman? <gasps> Red eyes. Red eyes. Call me Ogre. I hope to get to know you, young lady. But it's quite troublesome to think that corpses wander around the mansion. Corpses? Those monsters back there? They're like creatures from a story. Why would monsters like that suddenly... Well, it's a curse. What you saw were the corpses of your father's test subjects. Overcome with anger, those deceased have been brought back by the power of the curse. To take revenge on your father, of course. What? I have to save him. Why is that? Toward his own ends, he has killed countless people as part of his experiments. This is his retribution. You must have realized by now your father's true nature. And yet you wish to save him. she cannot yet understand their suffering. Understand their suffering. They're corpses, right? So, like, are they still alive? Are they still suffering? Mm -hmm. Well, no. If they're corpses, then, like, they shouldn't be able to suffer, right? Because they're technically dead at that point. So, like, would that mean that they've all just been, like, zest? Ah, <sighs> Hello! Altair, thank you for the raid. Welcome, welcome. Hello, leader. Hello, Coltair. Ah, welcome, welcome. Hello, Altair. Hope you all had a wonderful stream. I wasn't able to catch what you were doing, but thank you for stopping by. Welcome, welcome. <laughs> Hope it was a good stream. Hope it was a good stream. Love, Madfather. Have fun. Thank you, thank you. Hope you enjoy your time here, Coltair. <laughs> Go save father. Oh. Mm. A crow? Tip. Talk to crows to save your current progress with the story. There are game ending traps abound in this abnormal mansion, so be sure to save regularly. Let's go ahead and save. Yeah. Nice. Ooh, let's check out the door that's covered in blood. Let's get to father's lab. Okay, we'll check it out later. I love the, I like this. this is really cute. Oh, ooh, the piano. Ooh, the clock. The clock stopped at midnight. Ooh. The music is very soft, but I worry like raising it too high would make it difficult to hear. Because... Oh, a doll. If I kept walking, I might have stepped on it. When a red fog covers the screen, it means a quick time event has begun. You must press the button displayed on the screen within the time limit. If you fail, it may result in a game over. Ooh, ooh. Let's be careful. That's a lot of dolls. I think in the original, um, this was actually just bodies. A pile of discarded dolls blocked the way. This wasn't here when I came down earlier. I can't get through here. Need to think of a way to get to Father's Lab. And a way to proceed underground. <gasps> wow. 
Why was that doll moving? Is this part of the curse too? Spooky. All right, let's go check out all the areas here. Ooh, popper. Ooh, gem. <gasps> no. You yeah, watch out, popper's gonna get me. Mm. Ooh. Got firewood. It is a doggo, but it looks very angry. It, I think it might be one of the cursed doggos, so let's not mess with it right now. Crow. Hello, Haka. Thank you for the save. Huh? No. Ooh. Got a gem. Nice. Let's close the windows. Close the blinds. This one? I think. Close the blinds. Okay. Hmm. How do we get rid of the ooh shiny gem? Ooh, ooh. <laughs> the zoom ins are really good, right? I like that. I wish I could like zoom in um like manually on my own. Oh. Can't go through here. The archives. Ooh. It's locked. Oh, never mind. Darn it. The good thing they can't climb stairs. They actually can, but you, you you can like angle them up to like trap them in here. So like they can climb the stairs easy peasy. Like that. But what you can do is you can hook them in this little uh, cubby right down here. <laughs> Let's go explore more of the... Ooh. Okay, bathroom. <gasps> uh. Oh, jeez. <gasps> Wait, so... Did they start in the bathroom and go to the toilet? Or did they start in the toilet and then... Either way, it's very bad. It's a bad situation. Got a jet. <gasps> Oh, I totally forgot that thing popped out. <laughs> oh my gosh. Like, do you do it again? <laughs> okay, okay. We don't check out the bathroom. Wait, we do, because I need to figure out what this thing is. Oh, you can't interact with it. Oh, that's lame. Any story here? No lore. Uh, <laughs> the little drummer got me. <laughs> Ooh, these are really pretty dresses. Oh. Who is that? I. Whoever that was had like um blue hair? A dress for a doll. Maria said she's planning to throw this dress out because it's too raggedy. It feels like a waste to me. Hmm. Nothing in here. Hat. Hat. Hmm. I think we'll come back to this one a bit later. Are you going to do anything again? No. Let's keep exploring. Question mark. It's locked. Ooh, stairs. Wrong way. Oh. A life-size doll. Wait, did she blink? <gasps> <laughs> what the hell? That's rude. <laughs> All right. Is this the one? <gasps> yeah, that was the one. That was the one with the jump scare. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I, I knew one of these rooms had a jump scare in it. Some medicine that father takes. Ooh. 
a dial lock safe. It's locked and won't open. I don't remember the code to unlock it. Mm, ooh. <gasps> Give back my daughter. <sighs> she must have been one of the spirits that were, um, like, haunting the area. Because why is she a spirit and not a corpse? Because the ogre said that there were there are a few corpses that came back to life due to the anger, right? This one is looking for her daughter. But why is she a spirit and not a... Got the archive key. Hmm. Yeah, just one of those unfortunate victims. Hmm. Alright. Well, now that we have the archives key, let's go ahead and save. And this way, we can head over to the archives themselves, unlock the door, and find out what's inside. Wait, 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 wait. We haven't explored this room yet. Ooh. Reception room. Ooh. Hey, another crow. <gasps> Chair. <laughs> Powerfully moving painting. <gasps> oh. Uh oh. <gasps> oh. Oh. <laughs> Chat, I don't know if you can tell, but this game is actually pretty small. Um, the window that it plays on is very small, so like my face is actually pretty close to... Um, it's actually pretty close to the screen, which is why when all these sounds happen, it's like really spooky. The painting was hiding a cylinder lock safe. Can't open this without a key. Hmm. I feel like I just heard a voice. We can hear a voice in the fireplace? Spooky. I can't reach it. Ah, oh, wait, the chair. Oh, wait a minute. Hold up. If we go back and reset it, does the chair pop? Ah, it does. There we go. Got an old key. Ooh. Dolls in a glass case. More dolls in a glass case. There's a lot of dolls in here, aren't there? Oh. I'm sorry. <laughs> the chess pieces are on the board chat. <laughs> Alright. Now that we have that, we can go ahead over to the archives and unlock the archives. This one. There we go. Item. Archives key. Open the lock. And... Oh, there's so many crows. I feel safe whenever I see the crow. Hmm? The flame egg. Huh? Ah, I remember this book. There's a girl who has a mysterious power to control fire. And she goes on a journey to find the family she's been separated from. Proclaiming, burn all those in my way... She did exactly that to all her foes. But I think in the end, her power got out of control and destroyed the world. So she never met her family in the end. She was all alone. A poor girl all alone. If I lose father, I'll be alone too. I don't want it. I have to save father. Quick. Burn all those in my way. Yeah, I can burn it. I, but I'll need something to start a fire with. I think there was a part of the flame egg about making a torch to start a fire. I'll check the book again. I need to get, what? The girl cut her tattered dress with a knife, made a rag, and wrapped it around firewood. Finally, she tied the rag on with wire to create a torch. Okay, so tattered dress for the rag. Um... Firewood, I think we have that. 
and then a wire to tie it onto the torch. Mm -hmm. Let us keep exploring. Data on live experimentation. <laughs> An old diary. Humans are beautiful, but that beauty soon fades. That is a law of this world. But I have overturned it. After years of research, I have found eternal beauty. A body that will never fade, even in death. A body as fresh as it was in life. They have eternal beauty within their grasp. As we lose believers year by year, our group stands on the brink of extinction. My body, too, is nearing its limit. I must find a successor as soon as possible. Hmm. A successor. So, Chad, like, I wonder what that's about. A diary? But it's not just diary. It's like, almost like a cult. Because they mentioned something about, like, our numbers. Hmm. Our numbers must find a successor. Books on the occult. A diary. Ooh, another one. Extuary X. This is a nightmare. How could this have happened? Killed a bird. Just like... The rest of the pages are unreadable. Killed a bird just like... Just like who? What? Who killed the bird? What? Hmm... Anything else that we can explore? More data on live experimentation. Oh, there's something stuck in here. Got a code memo. <gasps> hey, I think we found a daughter. Mama, Mama, it hurts. Help me, help. Ooh. I want to go home. I want to see Mama. Don't worry. I shall take you to her. Once this is all over. No. I want to go now. Mama. Mama. <gasps> Don't fret. Everything will be fine. We just wish to test this medicine. It may hurt a bit, but not to worry. You'll soon feel such relief. No, Mama. Stop. Ah, <gasps> oh. Stop. I don't want this. sad. What the heck? Got a pendant. A pendant found in the archives. It's swaying back and forth as if searching for someone. Oh. Okay, I think we have enough information to figure out <laughs> to figure out where um the daughter went. Alright. And go save. Let's go take the pendant over to... Mission, there's a strange noise in the second floor west hallway. I think we finished that one. Alright, here we go. Uh, we can't talk to the ghost, but what if we... Oh, there we go. We can leave it there. This is her pendant. <gasps> Mama. Kalina. Mama. Aww. Aww. Got a gem. Guess we can just leave the pendant there. Aww, very cute. Alright. I think the other item we had was the code memo. Code memo. Written hints for unlocking the bedroom safe. With this, you can solve the safe code. 
chandeliers in the entrance hall, changing room hats minus the bathroom planters, red dolls in the doll room, and then barrels in the cafeteria. Uh... Okay, we're, we're gonna go through these one by one. Chandeliers in the main entrance hall. All right, let's go check out the chandeliers in the entrance hall. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Nice. Um, wait, what's the next one? I should have read the next one. Changing room hats minus the bathroom planters. Changing room hats. Mmm. Cafeteria? Oh wait, hold up. While we're here, we might as well go check out the kitchen, right? Uh... The number of barrels in the cafeteria. Alright, so this is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Right? Barrels. One, two, three barrel. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I think it's nine. Nine. All right. Now we're going to go find the changing room number of hats. And then the... This is the kitchen? This is the kitchen, right? And this is the cafeteria. Oh, they're different. Okay, they're separate rooms. Cafeteria, there's zero. There we go. Can you... <laughs> Uh, outing myself with the, the big cafeteria that doesn't exist for me. <laughs> Ooh. The doll that father made for me. Got a gem. Nice. A gorgeous chair. All right. The number of red dolls, right? One, two, three. They look more like pink. Four, five, six. I remember the curtains. So detailed. It barely seems like a doll. <laughs> one, okay, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight. Now when you go find the changing room hats and dolls, they're hiding, yeah. Where was the change room? It was down here, right? Cafeteria. Oh, it was on the right hand wing, I think. This one? Changing room. Alright. Number of hats. Uh one, two, three. Looks like five hats. Nice. I wait, why didn't I account for the other ones? Five hats minus the Bathroom planters. One planter. Two, three. Three planters. So five minus three is two. Four, two, eight, zero. All right. Let's go ahead and unlock it. <laughs> Four, two, eight, zero. All right. What's inside? What's inside here? I don't know the code to unlock it. Maybe the note I found is a hint. 4280. Oh. Ooh. Is it lore? It better be lore. It contains mom's belongings. I can smell mom's scent. Huh? There's a lamp in here. It's pretty dark, so it'd be nice to have a light. Just borrowing this, mom. Got lamp. Ooh. What is that? Mom's perfume. Aww. That's really sweet. Do you guys know, like, that your sense of smell is supposed to be, like, very closely related to, like, your, um, your memories? So, like, perfume is a very good way to, like, remember someone, um, like, precious. It's very cute. Aww. Is he still at work? 
something you view <gasps> love you maria <gasps> doctor eh F father oh <gasps> aya there you are doesn't your father always tell you not to go into the basement well mom hmm? <gasps> he i knew it he's cheating on me with her I can't believe this. Some girl he picked off of the street. Some girl he picked off of this. Wait, Maria's a girl he picked off off the street? That she was like trained as like a family help. Oh. <sighs> Stupid thing. Oh. Oh. Mom's usually so nice, but that day. She was like a different person. Hmm. This perfume. I'll put it back on her dresser after that, but... She took care of it. That's good. After all, Mom got this from Father on their anniversary. Aww. I'll take it as a good luck charm. Alright, Mom? Aww, cute. Wait, whoops, thank you for the super chat. Thank you, thank you. I wonder, yeah, I wonder if at that point the father knew that the mother was ill and was like, well, she's out soon, so. <gasps> Sorry, Chad, I need to like, focus real, real quick on this. Oh, there we go. <laughs> I wonder if at that point in time, um, like the reason why uh father was doing that like kind of stuff some medicine um was because like he knew that uh his wife was on the way out all right what else do we need um we got old key firewood gem and a lamp Ooh, we have a lamp yeah, I, that's so... That's terrible. Like, what the heck? That weird guy is gone. Snowball is relaxing. <gasps> Let's take Snowball. Here, Snowball. Snowball has father too, don't you? This way we have a bunny that we can pet on the way through. <gasps> Snowball. Snowball, where are you? And when your legs hurt too, what do I do? Ah, snowball! What did you get to? I was so worried when you disappeared. I couldn't wrap that wound with you running around. Wait, huh? Your wound's healed. Whew, what a troublesome rabbit. Father! Oh yeah, try not, try not to let Snowball out of your sight, will you? The rabbit's made a mess in the kitchen. Sorry, father. Snowball must have been trying to get a bite of Maria's cooking again, huh? Did you find Snowball, father? Yes, and fixed up the leg while I was at it. Good thing father's around, huh, Snowball? Thank you, father. Snowball's part of the family, treated as well as any other. Yeah. Aww, very cute. Snowball makes a mess in the kitchen, though, huh? What a troublesome rabbit. Let's go save Father together. Got Snowball. Oh. <laughs> Alright. Now that we have Snowball, let's head into the kitchen and make a mess. This way. <laughs> Alright. Okay, we don't want to go there. Not yet. Um... <gasps> Ooh. Okay, Snowball, I want you to make a mess in here somewhere. Oh, there it is. Ooh. Yikes, it's pitch black. Oh, the lamp. <gasps> Dr. Thank you for the super chat. Objects inside are blocking the door. Okay, 
I guess we can send Snowball in to make a mess. Please, Snowball. Oh, the pile of all these, like, grains, I guess, fell down onto it. Ooh. Got wire. Yeah, you play as the bunny. Hmm? Ah! <gasps> ah! <gasps> Wait, that was it? <laughs> okay, never mind, that wasn't it. <laughs> oh no, Snowball! Ah! Uh, oh. The light went out. Why... Why won't it work? Please. <gasps> Was someone behind me? <sighs> Just imagining it. Ooh. Spooky. <gasps> Potato. <laughs> Thank you for the super chat. Can I pick up the gem? Nice. Alright. I see that knife on the edge there. There's a ravenous dog devouring food. I should stay away. Hmm. I forgot how to get that knife. Backyard. Wooden barricade blocks the way. All right, there's nothing here, not yet. Hmm. We'll have to come back later. All right, let's see what else we have. An old key. Key found in the reception room. Doesn't seem to be a room key, though. Oh, wait. There was that one um, tumbler lock. The cylinder tumbler lock, right? We can go find that one. Down this way, right? If I remember, it was in here. Behind the painting. Yeah. Cylinder lock safe. Old key. Oh. Ooh. What is that? If I remember right, this knife is a memento from great grandma. Great grandfather. It might be useful for something. Should be fine to borrow it, right? Got a dagger. Specifically a dagger. Let's go and save. A memento from great-grandfather. Hmm. A dagger. Like a Dravis family dagger that's passed on. Uh, passed on, like, different generations, maybe. Wait, not the cafeteria. We need to go over to... <laughs> what do you have there? A knife! No! <laughs> David Gao, thank you so much for the super chat. Thank you, thank you. Right, we need to find a rag, right? A dress for a doll. Maria said she's planning to throw this dress out because it's too raggedy. Feels like a waste to me. Let's take a strip of the cloth. <gasps> Got cloth. Collected all the materials. Alright, wire? Firewood and cloth, and now, <gasps> and now, now we can head over. We make a torch, right? Why do we make a torch? What do we do? Oh, yeah, that's right. We had to burn the thing. Um, kitchen, kitchen, kitchen. <laughs> Must make fire. Ah, a container full of oil. Okay, let's go ahead and make the torch. Then, let's dip the torch inside. Soaked it with oil. And now, if I remember, there was a, a lit, lit fireplace? Was it the second floor? <laughs> Chad, why are you guys so excited to like commit arson? I'm seeing like everyone exclaim arson with cap uh, with a uh, exclamation marks, cheering them on. Go on, yeah, go set the pole place on fire. Tor, 
orange. Light the torch. Ooh. Lit the torch. All right. Now, with the lit torch, we can go ahead and set fire to... Ooh. Dane Vato Mortar? Ooh. The statue is all bloodied. Eerie. Okay. Let's set let's fire to the mall. A pile of discarded dolls bought the way. Burn the dolls. Yes. Oh. It burns. It burns. It hurts. Help me. The fire activated dolls. Hmm. Okay, the blood is still there. Ooh, smoky. <gasps> ooh, ooh. Tools for experimentations. More tools for experimentations. <laughs> what? Eerie objects stuffed into bottles. That's really creepy. This is all the same thing. Okay. Yeah. Oh. Got a bottle of eyeballs. Yes. That is what I would do. In a situation where there is... <gasps> Did one of the babies just open their eyes? I, th I thought for a moment, for like a split second, it opened its eyes. Yeah, let's just keep going. Wait, that means Aya must have passed through this room each time she came down here to the basement to, like, peek in on her father. Let's go save. Oh. Ooh. Maria. Mistress. You're wounded. Ah. But I'll be fine. Forget me. Escape somewhere safe. It is dangerous here. Where's father? I heard him scream from my room. That's right. I must save the doctor. Ugh. You can't go on like that. But... Maria, what happened to father? The doctor is further in. His wife, she... His wife? My mom? What do you mean? Maria? Maria? My... It seems she's passed out. <gasps> you again. At any rate, it sounds like your father has gone on ahead. Deeper into the underground maze. What did Maria see? My mom passed away, right? What's going on here? Don't tell me the curse affected her too. You'll only be able to confirm your suspicions by pressing on, won't you? Ooh. The music is like eerie. What a weird guy. She's fainting. Hmm? Okay. Before we continue, lore. Any lore? Any piece of lore? Books? Papers? Documents? Anything that we can report on? Nothing. Darn it. <laughs> Father! <gasps> Mom? But what's with the blood? M Mom? Is that you, Mom? Wait. No way. Was that really Mom? There's no way I mistook her. That was Mom. So even Mom is... 
It must be the curse, right? Haven't you noticed? This tragedy was brought about by the power of a woman's curse. The malice towards your father. That malice transformed into a curse, seeking out your father's death. Could that woman be... Yeah, so you do realize. Yes, your mother. That can't be right. Why do you think that? Because mom loved father. She even understood his work. Understood his work? What? Were they... Were they in cahoots? And he loved her back. Wasn't mom happy? I can't... I couldn't believe she has a grudge against father. But... Maybe mom didn't like father being with Maria. But then why... Attack father... And not just Maria? That's the question. I don't want it to be true, but... So, you'll find the truth. Ooh. Does mom... hate father? That can't be right. She promised. Okay, wait, chat. I just want to say real quick. Um, I just want to point out something... You good? Moving no longer. I want to say something really funny. Um, that like, <laughs> so Ogre was standing here, and was like, "Your father pressed Vaughn forward deeper into the dungeon. If you want to find out the truth, you must follow along." And then they go over here, and then he's like, "Oop, gotta hide." He just hides there. <laughs> then he waits for Aya to come over here and see the scene, and he's just kind of like, you know, hiding, like sticking his face, like trying to like squeeze himself behind the glials and he's just like waiting for the moment and after the dialogue he goes oh so you know the truth like <laughs> just imagining him like squeezing himself like between these two stands oh <laughs> uh, because like that's the only way you would explain it right because he would pop out here and he's like okay go out of here but no must hide and then <laughs> It's like, uh, it's like when you try to do the Batman thing, but IRL. Oh? Where is body? Head looking for the body in the mortuary. <gasps> Hello, friend. Oh. <laughs> All right. <gasps> Ooh. Oh, wait. Headless body. This one is looking for your body, right? Well, are you following me? Oh, this way. Found it. Thanks, Mrs. Oh, got a gem. I guess the curse is like it's bringing these bodies back. But maybe some of them just kind of, I don't know, like, they're kind of resigned, like, I'm dead and I've accepted that. So for this one, all he really wanted was just, you know, to find his body or to find his head and body back together, you know? Like, no anger, there's no point in being, you know, vengeful about it, you know? Maybe it's like that. That's kind of sad, like... To think of all these dead people. Ah. Oh. The door is firmly shut. But you can hear someone. Can't see. Can't see anything. That man took away my eyes. She's looking for eyes. Wait. We have a bottle of eyeballs. Um. I have some eyes here. Are these yours? I don't think she can hear me. Mm. Okay, we'll keep going forward. Oh, a wooden barricade. 
We'll keep moving forward and see if we can figure out how to get her the eyes. Charm Encyclopedia. <gasps> Ooh. Good luck charms. You want the ones you love to be happy. For this, a good luck charm does the trick. All you need is one more thing. And this you must have. It is love. Kiss someone's forehead with love and say a blessing. Then a spell of good luck will be cast upon them. Isn't that wonderful? Aww. Ooh, crow. <gasps> a doll wearing strange clothes. Tempest Enthusiast, thank you for the super chat. Love your RPG streams. Thank you, thank you. All right. Ooh, what's this out here? Nothing. I wonder who used to stay here. And what's with this tiny doll hiding her way? Hmm. Boxes, boxes. The metal fittings make this difficult to break. Shovel, pickaxe. Ooh, let's go up here. Hmm? A strong impact could break it. A strong impact. Ooh. Like a groundskeeper, maybe, because it is a pretty big place, right? Ooh. It's a chainsaw. I remember father scolding me for playing with this once. A chainsaw. <laughs> Ooh. Aya, uh, what are you doing with that? Sorry, father. This is no toy. It's a very dangerous tool. Understood? Never play with anything like this again. S sorry, father. I'm glad you're not hurt. It is odd, though. I thought I put this somewhere that I was out of your reach. Where on earth did you find this, Aya? Sorry. I'm sorry, father. Ah. <sighs> Somewhere out of the reach? Yeah, how did you get it then? The first time. Got a mini chainsaw. Ooh. SPX, thank you so much for the super chat. Whenever you have the chainsaw, you can press the special button to activate it. Special button is C or shift. It destroys crates or empty barrels. All right. Easy. Nice. Got a gem. Pile of barrels. Destroying this seems dangerous. <laughs> the sound effects are barely audible because of the, the volume. I think there was something that could destroy the chainsaw from the place I climbed up. Into the room I climbed up from. This one? No, I can't... S Why is that sound effect so loud? Mm. Ooh. <gasps> it's the little storage warehouse backyard area. And yeah, the doll is gone. Let's head back down here now that we have this. No way you can tear it down bareheaded, but we do have a chainsaw now. Ooh. A flame retardant. Uh, fire extinguisher? Okay, let's take the lat. Wait. It limits movement, so I'm going to take it easy first. The old man mumbles to himself. Curse that youngster, doing everything that woman says. And so deceive as to not realize her true nature. That woman's going to create a demon. She's even crazier than the doctor. <laughs> well, whatever. What should I care, I suppose? Hmm. Curse that youngster doing everything the woman says. The woman? The mom? Is it the mom? Is the youngster Aya and the mom? But the mom, mom hasn't told us to do anything yet. Right? Deceit not as to realize her true nature, woman's going to create a demon. She's even crazier than the doctor. So the only two women that we have right now are Maria and Mom. So it's got to be one of those two, right? The youngster must mean us. Do 
doing everything that the woman says. Is it us? No, it can't be us because mom hasn't told us anything. So, hmm. Guess we can use it for the ladder. I guess we'll figure out who the youngster is and who they are. So either Maria or mom is saying something or doing something. Got a gem. Easy peasy. All right. Okay, that doesn't work. Hmm. Most likely the mom. I don't, yeah, I don't think Maria is, is like telling anyone to do anything. Because Maria is still passed out here. Hmm. All right. Well, we have a fire extinguisher. A soot-covered drum that smells of burnt oil. Hmm. We do have a fire extinguisher, so... <laughs> what the hell is that? Um, let's go ahead and put out the fire... Archives? Mm, no, it was in the reception. Let's see what happens when we put out the fire with the fire extinguisher. <gasps> Oh, that was a big face. Oh my god. <laughs> oh. Oh, that was a big face. I don't know what that was. But yeah, that was spooky. Oh, wait, the crying. Sure enough. I hear that girl's voice. The girl who's crying, the one who has the missing eyeballs, right? I wonder, is this room connected to that place? Let's go and use the fire. Should put out a fire if thrown at the source. <gasps> there used to be these things called fire grenades. Um, where like you could throw it into a fire and it would explode and supposed to like coat the area with like a chemical that puts out the fire. But apparently they stopped using it because it was very dangerous. But I guess we still have these here at this time. Um, I forget what the chemical it was, but it's very dangerous apparently. <laughs> yeah, it's like a fire extinguisher, but it just pops and then it coats the area. Ooh. All right. Let's poke our heads in there. Or just throw the jar of eyeballs straight in there? No, but then the eyeballs will cook. You have to put out the fire first. Oh, there's gonna be a jump scares in there. Ooh. You hear a girl weeping from the hole. Bottle of eyeballs. I hope it didn't, like, damage the eyeballs. <gasps> <laughs> Look inside the fireplace. The girl's crying has stopped. Okay, I think we're good now. Alright, let's go save. <laughs> the little pixelated doll jump scare, right? All right, now let's head back downstairs. This way? No, the other way. Aha. And then we go through here, back down. Wait a minute. There's a faster way, isn't there? We can just go through the kitchen. <laughs> oh. Cafeteria, kitchen, there we go. <gasps> Oh, the dog is gone. Pupper is gone. Okay. Oh, that was dangerous. <laughs> All right, let's go through. What? What are you doing here? Eerie doll. All right. 
Let's go down this way. And now we can go talk to the girl. I found my eyes. Ooh, the sound. Ah, oh, I can see. I can see. Oh, she sounds happy. Ooh. Thank you. Oh. Got a gem. Oh. Man. That must be really terrible. Oh, what was that? I hope she's at least able to rest now. Yeah, rest in peace. Blue barrel. Red barrel. Blue barrel. Huh? Didn't I just go down the stairs? Red barrel. Blue barrel. Red barrel. Hmm. Wait, let's go backwards. Okay, let's try it one more time. Hmm? But Ooh. Hello? Um... <gasps> oh, she looks so tired. I wonder if she was trapped in here too. The... the looping... Uh... room? Staircase? Are you keeping me from going ahead? I need to go through here to save my father. So please, let me through. What can I do to convince you? Huh? Oh, she just wants to follow. Oh, okay. I guess we can go together, right? Oh no, we're both trapped in here. Maybe that's why she's so tired. Oh. Why are you following me? Why can't she speak? Do you want to go home? Oh, she nodded. Do you want to go out? Oh, I see. Come with me. I'll take you outside. Then let me through there, okay? Oh, the little nod. Oh, it's so cute. Alright, let's take her outside. What? Is she... <gasps> hmm? Huh? This place, it's the mortuary. We've been here before. <gasps> Wait. I... These are that woman's clothes. What's going on? Is Aya seeing... That... Woman's... Memories? Bodies. There's no body here, so it must still be fresh. Ish? Oh, this is Aya thinking. Father. Stay still, won't you? Father? Now, shall we begin? What? What's Father doing? Let me have those beautiful hands. Stop, Father. It's me. I can't speak. Oh, no. And there's no screaming because she's mute. Oh 
my god. I don't know if... I don't think... Her voice, her voice, like her voice, uh, vocal cords are taken out. I think she was just unfortunately. <gasps> oh no! Not moving at all. I think she. You know, in the same way that mothers mentioned that father had picked up Maria off the street, right? Maybe she was just a poor girl who was mute and, you know, couldn't find a job and was kicked out of her family's home. But onto the wilderness, you know? And then that's where he picked her up. Yeah. That's what I'm guessing happened. A lever style switch, but the lever is missing. The door is firmly shut. Yeah, because because like animals and humans, right? So is father going around just picking up people off the streets that you know the ones that don't have family, the ones that wouldn't be missed if they went missing, you know? What is he doing with the bodies though? A large mirror. A large mirror. Oh wait, it's a mirror. It's a sort of a it's reflecting the thing on the other side. <gasps> the doll again. Ooh. Yeah. Got a gem. Eh? Old man points totally still. Alright. Ooh. Water sitting in the tank. Cute. Ah, that's loud. That's very loud. Oh my gosh. Uh, wooden barricade. Okay, we can break that. Key in the toilet, but... Uh, sorry, I... Uh, forget it. This is way too gross. Alright. Me too, buddy. Me too. <gasps> Alright. Anything in here? No. Anything in here? No. And we get two... Yikes. Okay. We, we'll ignore that. We'll just ignore this. the man standing still. Hmm? It's locked. Ooh. The handcuffs are swinging violently, though seemingly not in use. They're locked. Hmm. Swinging. Handcuffs? I wonder if it's like a spirit or a ghost. A small doll. What is this like literal jail cell doing here? Oh. Reset the position. Oh, it's a puzzle. Okay, okay. Uh, in order to get that... I had to push. Wait. I have to push this from the side, right? Uh, sorry, check my brain. No, that's not it. <laughs> oh no. Okay, let's reset it. I think there's only one solution to this one. Like this. Or wait, do we have to go from the other side first? Because I have to push the one up there outwards. Okay, so maybe I do have to go the other way. Like that. No, that just puts me within the same place here, but without the ability to push this block over to the right. Okay, so I think it is left. I have not memorized this one as much as... 
There we go. Right? I can't touch that one, though. No, that's not it. <laughs> I think this is the one that I've had, like, the most amount of, like, difficulties with. Um, in terms of puzzles. RPG Maker puzzles, yeah. I don't know why. It's I've never been able to memorize the the answer to this one. Wait, that doesn't work. Box puzzles. No, you can only push, unfortunately. I have to get around to the right hand side to push this box to the left. How do I get there though? Because I have to get to that corner over there where Aya is pointing to. Oh no, this is going to take a while. <laughs> Can I push it down? No, that doesn't work. It has to be this one up, that. And then you out of the way. You, you, you. There we go. <laughs> Got the handcuff key. Easy. All right. Now, handcuffs. There we go. <gasps> there was a poor boy, like, shackled in there the whole time. Got a gem. 15 out of 20 gems. Nice. This one is locked though, so we need to find out. Oh, wait a minute. <gasps> wait, the key that we found in the toilet. I wonder if that's... But we can't pick it up because Aya thinks it's too dirty. The old man points. Points this way, right? Ooh. Astra, thank you for the super chat. Thank you, thank you. Ooh, fragile wooden crate. Forceps. Ooh. <gasps> you. Anatomish tabelan? Father was always reading this. It has a lot of gross pictures, so I don't want to look. Hmm. Snowball? The one with the damaged leg? <sighs> oh, so that wasn't Snowball. These rabbits, they kind of looked like Snowball. I don't want to look. Mm. I just got an achievement called Snowballs. It's eerie. They're looking at an anatomy book. Bodies. Give me your hands. So something that... Something involving bodies. Something involving like... Um... Human anatomy? <gasps> Ooh, that's quickly. What? How dare you do this to me? Never forgive. Never forgive. Um... I guess we can cut the rope, right? Oh. Ooh. Hello, gobbler. Well, or cobbler. Welcome, welcome. Thank you for the super chat. Finally caught live when the game is nostalgic. <laughs> yeah, I love this game. Okay, I've never understood this one, the large man, the quote-unquote large man, right? Like, who was he? Wait, whoops, thank you for the super chat. Thank you, thank you. Right, how did he catch him in the first place? What was he doing here? How long has he been here, like, hanging? And why was he strong enough to destroy all of this? Like, I don't know. 
Got a gem. Big handprints have been left here. I don't get it. Like, what? Oh, no. Mm, that's the thing I never understood. Probably another person father picked up. But what was he doing so far down here in the basement? And why is he alive at this point, you know? Broken destroyed everything except for a rope, right? His biggest weakness being elevated. Hmm. Alright, nothing in there. Oh. A nightcap. A little small for a human. <gasps> oh, the big man must have killed the... Killed the smiling old man. Ah, thank you for the super chat. I'm so sorry you can't read it. But thank you, thank you. I really appreciate it. Thank you, thank you so much. Ah. Huh? Okay, forceps to grab the key. Hooked up the cell key. Let's go and wash it here. There's water sitting in the sink. Mm hmm. Wash the key. Got a cell key. Yeah. No problem looking at dead people in blood, but she has a problem with the book. <laughs> hey, at least like the dead people are like props. You can think of them as props, right? Okay, let's go with the cell key. Is there anything that we missed here besides the snowballs? I don't think so, right? I think we should be good. Yeah, they never really clarified this part. Ah, uh, cell key. Open the lock. And... Save. Interesting. Interesting. Cut the barrels. Oh yeah, we should go ahead and uh, cut some of the barrels and see what's inside there too. <gasps> the super chat compliment of your voice, SPX. Thank you, thank you. Thank you for the super chat. Thank you. I'm, I'm glad you like my voice. <laughs> wine. That's red wine. <laughs> Seishun, thank you so much for the super chat. Previous super chat said, you have a cool voice. Thanks for the stream. Ah, thank you so much for the super chat. Thank you, thank you. Oh, ooh, all right. Let's head into it. Oh. Shh. Up ahead, you can't make a sound. Because if you do... <gasps> Imagine just waiting here. And your task is to help whoever comes forward. And the first person you see, you try to help. And then you just die. I'm hoping... I, Who were they? Traverse the area without making a sound. <gasps> Ooh. Okay, it resets us back to the beginning, so... I think that little crack in the ground is going to make, like, gravelly noise if I if I touch it, so... <gasps> Uh-oh. Ooh. <laughs> oh, nice, there's a little checkpoint here, okay. Wait for the mouse. I don't think it's a mouse, that looks more like a rat. There we go. Through here? Ooh, I want to open the door. I want to open the door, but it's gonna creak. It's a metal door. Oh. Oh. Okay. Wait, that taught us something. Friendly fire exists for the dolls. Friendly fire exists. Okay, okay. Oh? There are cracks in the floor. A strong impact could break it. <gasps> there 
we go. <laughs> Got a hand lever. Nice. Oh, <laughs> it just teleports us to the back of the room here. Okay, okay. I'm, I'm curious. I want to know. Can we open? I want to know. Is there lore? Is there lore? I want to open this. I want to open this. No. Okay, I guess not. <laughs> Darn it. I wish we could have like actually gone into that room. I want to know. I'm sorry, but thank you for the warning. Ooh. All right, now that we have the hand lever, we can go ahead and get to that switch that we saw earlier. Wine. Wait, what was that? Is the door still open? Check if the door's still open. Ooh. That's right, it reset us back to the beginning, but I don't think the door... <gasps> yeah, 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 yeah. Ah. <laughs> I rushed too far. <laughs> Wait for the rat. Ooh. Rats. No, it's still it's closed. Is there anything else here? There's like this doll that's been like impaled. Sadness. Wait, maybe it did it just reset because I, I left the area? Okay. Ah, oh, no, it just immediately closes. Darn it. Ah. <laughs> uh, that would have been a really cool way to do a little secret of like um, hiding something behind the door. Like you had to trigger the, the quick time event first and then you have to like escape. And then after you survive, you can go back to it. That would have been cool. But alas, does not look like it. The lore of whatever is behind that room will be kept secret for another day. Hand lever time. Nice. Ooh. All right, let's go save before we hop in there. I'm actually really, like, excited that I haven't died yet. Oh. Ogre, you might not be able to go back for a while if you go this way. The door is firmly shut. All right, this way. Never mind then. Oh, same dialogue. Okay. I guess we can open it. <laughs> Ooh. Save. What's in here? It's like a little dining hall. Ooh. Okay. Nothing there, nothing particular. Ooh. Oops. Hanging meat. Hanging meat, wait a minute, can I? Ew. <laughs> Yandies, thank you so much for the super chat. Thank you, thank you. Really appreciate it. Hope I can keep giving you comfy vibes even though these are horror games. Uh, ooh. Flame has been left on. <gasps> Wait, can we cook the hanging meat on there? Cook the sausage. Nice sizzle. Good sizzle. If it has mold on it though, I would not recommend. Finished sauteing the sausage. Wait, Aya knows how to saute food? Oh, okay. I'll take it. Select, carry the sausage, limits movement, leave it be. Oh, I... We'll leave the sausage here for now. Ooh. <laughs> it's an excellent burger. <gasps> what? <laughs> uh, uh, I can't breathe. Let go. Ooh. Hmm? 
did someone pick us up? Or like, tucked us into bed or something? The red-eyed stranger gave Jack the power to curse others. And Jack said, Thank you, red-eyed stranger. Now I can get my revenge. I wonder if the red-eyed stranger they're talking about is Ogre. Because we, we've seen that like referenced a couple times. Hey, Mom? Yes, I am. What's Father always up to down below? It's a very difficult job. <gasps> so she did know. Yeah, this confirms that she did know about what what um what father was doing. SPX, thank you so much for the super chat. Thank you, thank you. You'll understand when you're older, I am. I wanna be older soon then. I uh Whatever happens, you shouldn't hate your father. Mom, why say that all of a sudden? Of course I wouldn't hate father. I see. Mom, do you not like father? No, nothing like that. I'm just like you, Aya. I love your father very much. Phew. <laughs> he can be a bit unpredictable. So, let's both support him, no matter what. Promise? Okay. Now, back to the story. Oh, they're really cute. Dude. Very, very cute. I promised mother that no matter what, I'd support father. Wait for me, father. Oh. Hmm? You've come too. Oh, he's bandaged up his eye. Oh. Don't worry. I'm your ally. Huh? Sorry I gave you a fright earlier. My appearance must have surprised you. Mm. That wound on your face, was it from my father? Don't worry about that. That's in the past, so it was. It was from his father, but... How? Is he alive? It, wait, is he... He's gotta be dead though, right? Like, this is another one of the cursed bodies. Everyone has an alpha father. You hate him too, don't you? Cursing your father's name isn't going to save us. Mm. But I've come to save you. Let's get away from here together. I can't. I have to save father. Don't go. Some of those creatures will try to drag you into death as well. Drag you into death as well. Oh. If you stay here... They'll take away your life. But I promised that I'd save father no matter what. Give up on your father. No, I'm going to save him. Let go. Listen to me. She asked me to do this. She... <gasps> she? Who's she? <gasps> Maria. Mistress. Mistress, are you alright? Maria. Mm -hmm. Mistress, why will you not escape? Because, Father. Leave the doctor to me, please. You have my word, I'll bring him back. So please, Mistress, you must flee somewhere safe. <gasps> Did she just step on it? Maria, let me go with you. If anything happened to you, Mistress, the doctor would mourn. Besides, what awaits ahead? Well, it would be harsh for you, mistress. I shall go ahead alone. Oh, it would seem that she's coming to greet me. The lady. Oh, Mom? This shall not go as you wish it. I shall settle this. So we know a couple of things now. She asked me. The blonde boy said she asked me, which means that at some point, 
Oh yeah, don't go. Oh. It's an honor to be allowed to stay and work here. No need to be so formal. You'll be living here after all. Feel free to think of us as a family. No, I couldn't. Please, don't be so modest. It's been hard since your family passed, yes? <gasps> He's an orphan? <sighs> well, yes, but... I recall you saying you had a sister, correct? Wait, Snowball. <sighs> Sheesh, always quick to run off. That girl is my daughter. Which makes you... Or which makes her your new little sister. My new... Sister. Is that why she's so protective of her? It's because he's trying to protect it all. Her name is Aya. I'll introduce you to later. She can be terribly shy. So she might not think much of you at first, but... Be nice to her. Yes. He lied. Father lied. <sighs> That's why Aya doesn't know who he is. Father told him that he would introduce the two together so that they would be like brother and sister, right? But he never did. He picked off the boy off the street and then <sighs> performed experiments on him. And then they never met. New sister? How idiotic. As if anyone could replace her. Oh, she's humming, but the humming is very quiet. Mm. <sighs> oh. <laughs> You'll catch a cold sleeping here. Still a flashback because he has both his eyes. Mother, I love you. Mm. Oh, <laughs> this is too cute. You know, this takes me back. I think you are just a little bit like my sister. She was right. Or she was right there, but I let her die. Only I made it out of alive. I'm sorry. No. Mother, don't go. You've lost someone too, precious. You some you've lost someone precious too, Aya. You've gotta let go and move forward. There's no need for a replacement. But when I see your innocence, it makes me want to protect you. I'll keep protecting you and your family, Aya. You can count on that. <sighs> and even in death, he's still trying to protect her. Save, but we're gonna go and follow Maria. Hello, who are you? So hungry. Hungry, wait a minute, we cooked sausage, right? We sauteed some sausages. <gasps> Did anyone else see that? There was something behind the stand. It's not there anymore, though. Oh, wait, the legs. Never mind. I'm seeing things. <laughs> so hungry. Um, would this be okay? Ah, uh, smells just like the sausage I like. Hmm. 
Mmm. Mmm, so good. Tastes a lot like mom's. Tastes a lot like mom's? Well, not quite to mom's standards, but it was pretty tasty. I ain't had a bite to eat since I was locked up here. I was starving. Maria always brought food down to the basement. <gasps> was it Maria was bringing food down here to feed the prisoners to help the father continue these experiments so they don't die of hunger? This must have been... Maybe it was a family. Did he pick up a family? And like, father let his mom like cook here, right? Maria always brought down food... To, Always brought food down to the basement. Didn't you have that? Everyone else was getting food, but not me. I was always unwanted. <sighs> no use and just pissed people off. So I was abandoned. Oh, okay. So the, he was kicked out of his house by this mom? Have this. Got a napkin. You know... As thanks for giving me good food. Eh. Well, um. Thanks, I guess. Yeah. Oh. <gasps> Aww. Oh. Poor kid. Okay, I revised my theory on the kid. He was kicked out of his family's house because he was useless. And then. Father picked him up off the streets, just like everyone else. Just like Maria, just like the blonde boy, our brother, or our, like adopted stepbrother, I guess. It won't open. <gasps> oh, the creepy ghost thing again. Ooh. <laughs> It's you. The passage was a little cluttered, so I cleaned up a bit. What did you do? Mission, solve the gimmick room. Ah, <gasps> this doll looks like me. The girl doll, it's so pretty. The mirror room, oh. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Mirror room, so they holding a spear. Okay, let's take the spear away for now. Where would this spear go? Oh, the suit of armor is holding it. Okay. Then we have to push that over there. Uh, this doll is missing a head. Is it just me or are there like a lot of dolls? Like an incredible amount of dolls. Let's take some flowers from there, and then move it over here to this side. Bang. Okay, there we go. And now the only thing we need to find is a head, right? Ooh. A beautiful doll standing quietly. Oh, it's a blonde doll. Wait, wait, wait. We can use the head. Got the doll head. Yeah. Now, it's the same blonde head. Doll head? Ooh. Why did it sound so juicy? And then, let's see. The last thing here is one, two, three. With the crack on it, so... Crack. And now we stand here. <gasps> Ooh. Nice. I'm going to be honest, this this giant bow on the back, very cute. Alright, let's go. <gasps> Did that... The doll of a beautiful woman. Alright. Oh, let's go ahead and save here. It's a big library. Ooh. Oh. Oh, okay. We're going into the book. I see, I see. Extuary X. I was born. 
I slept cuddling up against my mother. Ooh. A cold flame blocks the way. Ooh. Wait. This. The woman statue and the baby statue are lying down far apart. I slept cuddling up against my mother. Cuddling, right? Ooh. A mother and her baby sleeping clothes. Aww. Okay, next chapter. X Jury X. I killed an animal for fun. Then I got addicted. There's always dead cats and birds in my room. Mother gets mad when she finds them. Whenever mother is out, I hide the corpses in the dresser. In the dresser? A dead cat. Carry the corpse. We put them in the dresser, right? Oh, we're making the memories of these... Of this... Uh, like this little scene. Match the, di the diary entries. Like that, right? And then... Whenever mother is out. So we gotta push mother out? Like that. The boy looks bored. The boy looks bored. Who's the boy? There are corpses in the dresser. Corpses in the dresser. Corpses in the dresser. Alright, next chapter. Extrary X. Mother found out I was killing animals. Mother scolded me. Shut up. I silenced mother with a knife. Mother fell all over, fell over, all red. It didn't suit such a pretty face, so I wiped mother's face. Her dead face was very pretty. I silenced mother with a knife. A doll wearing strange clothes, so... Mother has collapsed bloody, but... We need the knife, right? Wait, you're holding the knife. The boy is covered in blood. Okay, so in the memory, you're holding the knife. And then I wiped mother's face. Napkin. Her dead face was very pretty. Very pretty. Something about beauty? Didn't we see a diary entry about someone taking... Was it... Was it father's diary entries about how he can preserve the beauty of dead humans? Is this father? Is this boy dad? <sighs> he started this young. What? Okay, let's keep going. x X. I killed mother. I got scared and ran away. Far, far away. Across the ocean. I wanted to forget everything. But I couldn't forget mother's pretty... Mother's pretty dead face. I killed another. Eventually, I got addicted to seeing people's dead faces. The boy wields a pickaxe looking down at a girl. The girl is terribly frightened. What? You went overseas. He killed another. She's frightened. Wait, can we chainsaw? Decapitated. Okay. So he started in Japan, killing animals, and then he went overseas. I guess this is why we're in Germany now. And that was it. Oh. Okay, let's go and save. I have a suspicion. I have a, like, I have a, th something is bothering me. I want to go check back on something later on. Oh. Q 
juicy. Zero reaction from Aya though. Not even like a gasp. <gasps> Kill me. So are some of these are corpses and others are not? Like, ooh, like that's that's an actual body, body part. Like we're we're hop skipping and jumping over it. Huh? But like the other body that we just that we just killed, it vanished. Like some of the bodies vanish and others don't. I wonder what the difference is. anymore. I have to say father. Father. Oh. oh no. She must be really exhausted after all of that. At your limit, are you? Perhaps you should rest a bit. Okay, maybe he's not that much of a bad guy. Come here, Aya. Mom, you're warm. Close your eyes, Aya. Ah, oh, wait. Is that the good luck charm? You kiss them on the forehead, then you say a blessing. May you be smiled upon. Mom, what was that? A good luck charm. Oh, it was. Oh. oh, it's so cute. Oh my god, my heart. A what charm? I charmed you, so you'll always, always be happy from now on. Wow, I love you, Mom. Oh, That's really cute. Mom, you smell nice. It's the perfume Mom always wears. <gasps> we have a bottle of... <gasps> can smell mom's scent. Why do you smell like mom? Oh, the perfume bottle. Who could say? No, that's mom's perfume. No way. When did you... Give it back. That's my keepsake of mom. We gotta go find, we gotta go find it again. But first, stuffed dog. But first, lore. Okay, no lore. Let's go find her. Where'd she go? In here? It's locked. Okay, in here. Rats. Okay, we can't go that way. <laughs> I saw my health bar pop up and I was like, wait a minute, no. Oh. Okay, it's still just the dog. Mm. I don't have any items other than the lamp and the chainsaw, but I'm already using the lamp to light the way. Oh, a rusty key. Oh gosh, you can see the rats already like piling up. Ooh, get out, go, 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 go. That's very close, oh my god. Okay, rusty key. I wonder if it opens this one. Open the lock, nice. 
Who are you? Come here. It's okay. Don't be scared. Huh. <laughs> Guess this scent's no good. Animals seem to hate it. Give back mom's perfume. Hehe. <laughs> what's, what's so funny? Huh? You don't have it? Where did you put it? I don't know. Why not search for it? What? What was with her? Why was she trying to like get the doll or like get the rat? A dress. Rat. No rat. No rat. Ooh. Hey, it's the puppy. But this one has a bone. Ooh. What is that? Oh, she hid it inside the wall. Okay. There it is. Mom's perfume. Thank goodness. <gasps> Ooh. Oh, wow. That's a, that attacks really quickly. Oh, my God. <gasps> oh. Did it stop? Oh, it's still there. Okay. Let's get out of here. <laughs> ah. Wait, hold up. What? There's a message in blood on the wall. You said I'd be family. You lied. <sighs> Wait, the blonde boy. Is that the blonde boy? Hmm. Maybe it might be the blonde boy. Memento of mom. Animals seem... It seems animals dislike it. If we spray some on, that should keep us safe from the rats, right? Just a little bit. Okay, mom? Three space. Good. Good amount. Doused yourself in perfume. Ah, <gasps> We're good. We're safe. Let's go. <laughs> I wonder... Oh? Uh... Rude? Oh my god. Imagine like what kind of a power move that is to just stand there and like the moment someone passes you, you vomit blood and vanish. Like that's rude. Like I would be so self-conscious about my outfit that day if that were the chase. Like, come on. <laughs> Right? <laughs> Just barf blood and pieces out. <laughs> Whoa. Ooh. Oh, these are so pretty. What? Vomits doesn't elaborate leaves. Right? <laughs> wow, these are so pretty. Oh my god. Ooh, look at that. <sighs> what? The disgrace of the Dravis family. That's our family, but... Did... Wait... What a sick man. He made his... Like, you see how these are like little, um... Like dioramas? Like little exhibits, right? He went ahead and made a diorama. The disgrace of the Javis family. Who was that? A sister? Mother? Why would you go out of your way to make a doll of someone in your own family, call them a disgrace, and then recreate their own, like... What? That is messed up. Oh? Ooh. What is this? A coffin. Beautiful flowers are spread over it. Ooh, let's save. Oh. Keep that open. Nothing over there. Oh. oh it has an axe. Run from the killer doll. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Okay, can we... We 
can hide inside the coffin for a little while. Sleep in the coffin, not sleep again. <laughs> Alright, let's go ahead and sleep. Maybe the doll will be tired and will like ignore us after a while, like if we pretend to be a doll ourselves. <gasps> there were stairs hidden under the coffin. Ooh. What is... Huh? I don't know what that is. It looks like a boiler. Ooh. What is that? Got an herbicide. An herbicide? Vines are keeping it from opening. If we use the herbicide on the vines, then... Okay. What kind of a diorama is this? Hmm. Wait a minute. Hold up, hold up. Oh, I see, I see, I see. Okay. Okay, we run for the killer doll by doing this. So we block that exit, and now we have to run over to the other side. And then block that one. Let's go ahead and save. Alright, now we can keep going through. And... Oh? What is that? Oh, another doll. Oh. Ooh. Why can't I go through here? You won't pass. The gate? Like there's a barrier? You must be keeping me from going in. You won't pass. Why are you getting in my way? Is it like... haunted? Hmm. Yeah, going full Gandalf. <gasps> You'll have to destroy the doll if you want to get any further. Burn it up real good and the spirit inside will burn real good too. And then poof goes the invisible barrier around the door. Stop. <laughs> Ooh. Do you believe that, Brett? Hmm. Got a creepy doll. Dispose of the creepy doll. Okie dokie. Oh. Hey. There she is again. Oh, she opened the door for us. I want to know who that is. So we have the... Oh? Who is this short-haired girl, and how is she able to open all these doors like that? Oh, no. The cat is dead. Not moving a muscle. Poor cat. Ooh. Ooh. Let's go ahead and save. All right. Avoid detection by the killer dolls. <gasps> Ooh, okay. Oh, wait. There we go. Uh, we should be safe. Ooh. And then swing. Go through. Easy. <gasps> oh, wow, that one is so fast. Why is it so fast? Oh, inside. Okay, now we can go. Whoa. <gasps> oh my gosh, there's so many. Swing. All right, there. Good. Oh. A doll wearing strange clothes. Maybe, okay, it looks like it's wearing a Japanese kimono, but like, from Aya's point of view, Aya has never been to Japan. That's why it's always a strange clothes. But why are these dolls sticking around here? Like, are they signs of the past? Is that why he keeps them? Because father used to grow up in Japan before he, before he moved here to Germany. The head came clean off. Ooh. Got a gem. 
Ooh, that was close. <laughs> oh, thankfully it just like put me right back here. Yeah, easy peasy. Oh, hey crow, good to see you. What is, wait, what? Tunnels outside the incinerator. Incinerator, okay. Ah, what are you doing? Why do you want to help her so bad? Help her so bad? What? Who's the her? Helping her won't get us back to normal. The mom? Us? Why not drag everybody here? That way it's more fun. Oh, drag everybody here. Kill them all so they end up as ghosts too? <gasps> Stop. <gasps> what? What happened? <gasps> There's a scalpel in her chest. Pull out the scalpel. Oh? Got a scalpel. Why? Oh, oh no! I... Yeah. <gasps> Wait. She knows our name. She knows our name. Oh. You rotten thief. You're gonna pay if you come back here again. Poor thing. Come to my home. I'll get you some good food. <sighs> so he is picking people off the streets just like that. Don't be shy. As of today, you're part of <gasps> the message written in blood. You lied. You said we'd be family. That's her. As of today, you're part of the family. This is Aya, your little sister. <gasps> oh, she was such a tiny baby back then. <gasps> I'm gonna be a big sister? Hey, Aya, it's me, your sister. Oh. Is that why she was just like playfully teasing and Playing like messing around with Aya and not like actually hurting. <gasps> you told me I'd be family. You lied. <gasps> Father. I just want to be part of your family. <sighs> I'm sorry. Oh, so the boy and the girl and the mute woman and all those are victims. Not moving at all. The doll is smiling eerily. It's holding a knife. A doll with hollow eyes. So those, these are the dolls that attacked her. Oh, I see. It's locked. Man, I feel terrible. I wonder, after learning all this, what Aya feels about her dad. There's a key here. It must be for the incinerator. Oh, something's coming. Oh, it's the dog from earlier. Are you... Oh my god.
The key is gone. Obtain the key swallowed by a dead dog. Alright. Ooh, save. Uh, restrain the twin doll. <gasps> Ooh. Okay, don't make a noise. Don't make a sound. Twin doll. It has two heads like stuck on it. Uh, ooh. I wonder if I can reach that chandelier. Uh, ooh, a wooden plank. Maybe I could use this plank. Move it. Okay. So we have the plank out there, but... It's like precariously on the edge. If I stand on the... If I stand on it, it's gonna fall over. Sandbags. I could use these as weights. Nice. Okay. Now it's properly balanced and I can stand on top of it here. Alright, and then... Gotcha. Easy. <laughs> The doll has been crushed. What's inside here? Won't open. Alright. We will just ignore that. <gasps> Lights. We'll ignore that for now. Ooh. The door is firmly shut. Solve the cultivation room puzzle. I don't know what that is death to those near it. Oh, okay. Oh, oh, this is really pretty. This is cute. Okay, uh, is that a cat? Okay, Aya's face goes there. Okay, and then Aya's chin goes here like that, right? Or no, that's a cat. So... We want to bring the cat pieces to the bottom. But not too much to the bottom? Like that. Okay, okay. So this is the order that needs to go in. And then the cat paw. Where does the cat paw go? I like that it lights up whenever you get to the right spot. Oh no, not again. I wish I could figure out what's causing all these network issues, but I've been having a whole bunch of these for a while, and it's been difficult. I'm not too sure how to fix it. Uh, let's see. These refresh. I think we should be back. Oh. Are we back? Hello everyone, good to see you all back again. I apologize, we're having network issues. It's been now two days in a row that we've had network issues. It seems we're good. Okay, that's good to hear. That's good to hear. I don't know, chat. I'm really sorry. I don't know how, if, I wish I could know how to like fix it, but alas, it is something that's out of my control. It's uh, it's been a thing that I've had for a while now that it's been causing like some uh, network issues, but unfortunately, I don't know how to fix it. I'm sorry, Chad. Hang on, I'm gonna just shuffle around the pieces so they are in the right order, like this. <laughs> Hopefully I'm able to do this without too much uh, more, like, issues. Uh, if so, I'll try not to make too much progress in the game while uh, things are stuck. That way everyone is able to uh, stay caught up with the rest of the game. But yeah, yeah, yeah. I hate these puzzles. I do too. They are very difficult for, for my brain to like wrap itself around. Um, I think it goes down like this, right? Up. 
up here. Yeah. And then... It's the YouTube algorithm. <laughs> They're fine once you get them. I think we can keep this one here in the middle. And just like rotate all of these. Until we get to... Oh, wait. Too far, I think. Because we got the ear in this now. I'm gonna get this part of the dress down below here. How do we do that? Oh wait, we can line it up like that. And then shuffle the entire thing over, right? Like that. There we go. And now we just have to rotate these. How do I get them in order? Uh, like, because this one has to go in front of this other piece. If we spin them entirely. I used to be good at these puzzles, but I guess I am like... No, they're backwards now. Oh no! <laughs> I'm sorry, Chad. I'm not that great at these puzzles. There we go. That goes there. We need to swap these two. Wait. Even if we were to swap them, we would be missing a piece, wouldn't we? Right? So then... Hang on. Let's solve as much of it as we can. And then we gotta look for the last remaining piece. We'll give up for now. And I wanna just check. Okay, good, good, good. It, stay, it stays. <laughs> give up. Don't accidentally hit reset. All right, let's go look for that last missing piece. It's got to be down here, right? How convenient. Got a puzzle piece. Ooh. All right. Pupper. Okay, so we have to get the key out of the puppy somehow. Right there. Uh, wait, give up. And then item first. Puzzle piece. Okay. Despite the fact that the father may be a mad scientist going around killing a lot of people, I think it's very cute that he has a puzzle of his own daughter as like the lock to whatever this room is, right? Okay, like, let's give credit where credit is due. This is adorable. This is very sweet. I like it. Okay out of context of the whole, like, him being a... Where'd the blood come from? <laughs> Chat's like, I, I mean, I guess. Very big conflicts here. <laughs> Ooh. A potted almond. Uproot? No. Um, leave it. Take the pot, though. Yeah, I did the whole thing. He's just a silly guy. <laughs> I mean, okay, you can be a serial killer and, like, you know, care about your daughter, right? Okay. Crane game time. Run away, run, 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 run. As far as we can get. Oh! Oh, that's really loud. Rest in peace, pupper. Oh, hey. You want to attack me, right? That's kind of cute. It's fainted. Ah, see, it's not dead. Wait a minute. Medical knife. Scalpel. 
I'm sorry, pupper. I'm sorry. Ooh, the sound. Oh my god. Got the incinerator key. It's fainted. See, chat? It's not dead. It's still fainted, right? It's already it was already dead. <gasps> hey! <laughs> what? For me? A bone? Oh. You're so cute. Thank you. <gasps> what happened in there? Fainted like Pokemon, right? Yeah. Hey. Oh, they're actually kind of adorable. Ooh. Wait, did you? Why are you so, like, bulbous? Okay, I'm going to try something. I don't know if... The, I don't remember if this is the right way to do it, but... Chainsaw time. Ooh. Oh, it was a gem. Nice. 18 out of 20. We're almost there, Chad. Ooh. Okay, now can we... It won't open. All right. No. No, that's sus. That is so sus. I'm not going in there. <laughs> All right. Now that we have the incinerator key, go ahead and... Oh. Incinerator key. Open up the incinerator. And then hop inside. That's a lot. That's wait. That that doesn't sound like an incinerator. That sounds like lava. What? Like a pit of magma? It's spouting with flame. Who knew this was down here? You'll have to destroy the doll if you want to go any further. Burning up real good, and the spirit inside will burn up real good too. Then poof goes the invisible barrier around the door. Are we back? Oh no, Chad, I'm so sorry. <laughs> A little stutter, okay. We'll take we'll take it slow. Hopefully it's not it we won't have any more interruptions. Arson season two, right? Yeah. I guess we do have to. It's staring right at Alia. But it is described as a creepy doll. So let's go ahead and toss it. <laughs> oh, I just got the warning from OBS now again. Oh, no. We'll just chill a little bit until it reconnects. My goodness, we have a lot of network issues today. Ah. Uh. Do -do. I think afterwards I'll go back and check the logs and see if we can figure out what's going on, but are we back now? Okay, okay. Alright. Sorry, Chef, for all the network interruptions. I'm not sure what's going on today. It's been like this for a couple of days and I haven't been able to figure out exactly what it is. I'll go and like reset my router again one more time after like yesterday as well. Mm. <clears throat> Sorry, Chad, I'm just gonna like stretch a little bit while we wait. Oh, I was sitting down for like three hours and not moving. My back. <laughs> Are we back now? All right, let's go. All right, love to see it, love to see it. Thank you so much for being so patient, Chad. I really appreciate that. The posture check, yeah. Oh, my back. Ooh. <clears throat> we'll have to see about that. Stop. Stop, please. Aya. Oh, the doll knows her name. Mom? Please, Aya. 
Listen to your mother. Wait. You're not mom. Mom had longer hair. Stop. You're not my mom. Please, Aya, listen to your mother. I want to see you, my sweet daughter. That's, yeah, that's not how mom talks. Stop it. Oh. Ooh. I wonder if, like, the dolls, like, know of... It's spouting with flame. Like, know of the mother and, like, what the mother's been doing, you know? All right. So we got rid of the doll, and now it's time to head back into... Oh. Yeah, let's just go ahead and skip this part. Um, now it's time to go back into the doll area and now we can finally get through that one door um that had like a what was it the barrier the invisible barrier <laughs> oh no it's still dead how did cat end up here down like all the way down here the cat's eyes are wide open it's as if it's glaring at you oh <gasps> Ooh. Eerie. Okay, wait. Ah. Uh, killer doll, are you still here? <laughs> You're still here. Yeah, yeah. Wait. Bone. Wait, before we go into the room with the barrier that we now closed, let's go give the bone to the dog. Because uh, we saw that picture of it, right? I wonder if our perfume still... Okay, our perfume still works. Nice, nice, nice. That one has the killer doll in it. This one. There we go. Nice. Stuffed dog. Bone. Nice. Ooh. Gem. <sighs> one more, Chad. One more. Just one more. Also, wait. Check the open door. This one? Oh, It's a dress. Alright, let's just keep going. Is there a gem in the rat room? I don't think so. It's a corridor. I don't see anything sparkling on the ground. But yeah, just one more, one more. Alright, now we can head over into... That... One room. Heh. <laughs> Alright. Okay, here we are, here we are. Ooh. Why? Oh, wait, is that? Didn't you know from the beginning? And yet you still want to help him. I don't know. I don't know what I should do, but I have to go. Father's all I have. And also, whatever happens, I'll support father, because that's what I promised mom. You're still going on about that. Your mother's forgotten about any promise, and now she's torturing him. That might be true, but... I know she was sincere about her promise. So, even if mom can forget about it, I can never forget about it. If you go save, fa if you go save your father, won't innocent people suffer again? I'll prevent that. I'll prevent that from happening. Prevent it? How? My father's a kind person. I know he can change. her favorite doll. What a child. People don't change that easily. Her favorite doll. What's this? This portal leads to the other world. Ooh. He's up ahead. 
Are you truly going? A reality too harsh for such a young lady may be awaiting you. Will you go regardless? You seem adamant. Then, let me give you this. What's this, mister? Magic water. A new product of my company. Company? Product? He actually is a salesman. What? Magic water? Sounds like something out of a story. Please, take this with you. The power kept within the water shall be, shall no doubt be of help to you. Can I save father with this too? Of course. The water has the power to seal the power of the curse. So, I can stop the curse. Mom. She must be in pain. So I have to save mom too. Will mom be able to rest once the curse is gone? Yes, I'm sure she will. If your love reaches her, I am sure your mother can be saved. Okay. Thank you, mister. It was nothing, madame. I pray for your safety. Woo. Save. <gasps> These are very pretty dolls. If you wish to return to your room, I could take you straight there. Return to your room. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's one thing I wanted to check. I wanted to check before we head over. Whoa. Nursery. There's something I want to check in here. Oh my god. Oh my god. There's a dead cat inside. Okay. I have to confirm. I have to confirm. Hang on, chat. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. There's a dead cat inside. Data on live experimentation. Diary. x Jerry X. This is a nightmare. Aya killed a bird. Just like... Dead cat. Dead bird. Dead... Just like... The father... Is that why there was a dead cat down there in the basement? Because like, huh? what the hell? Oh, oh, shh. I can't believe that worked. <laughs> I thought that would, that I was a hundred percent certain that that was gonna catch me. What's in here? Got a gem. <gasps> what the? Who? The hell was that? Okay. <gasps> oh, 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 The life-size doll. It looks just as if it were a real corpse. Okay. Ooh. Okay, before we go though, I want to go check and see if there's any room that we haven't like. It's locked. We don't know the room. We don't have a key to this one. Hmm. Yeah, we got them all. All 20 gems. Okay. Oh. <laughs> Felt like something grabbed my leg. <gasps> I'm gonna get dragged away. Oh. Oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. <gasps> oh. There 
are so many great time events. Okay, I think we're good. I think we're good. Okay, well, I think we have everything we need. So, I guess we can go ahead and save here. Here, let's make a second save. So, if we find out that we missed something, we can come back here. But for now, let's head to the basement. Jump into the other world. No going back. I want to know what's in that question mark room, the one that's locked, because we never found a, uh, a key for that one. Ooh. Oh, we left our chainsaw and a lamp. So she went. What will she choose, I wonder? Oh, I shall see this to the end. Point of no return, yeah. That's right, zero deaths so far. Oh no, I jinxed myself. I'm gonna die next time I see. Hmm. This is... It's like some storybook world. Better move on. Ooh. It's eerie because it says right there in the bottom left-hand corner, Other World. The dark space. <gasps> oh. Hey, we're all here. Mom. I, uh... So you came, did you? So it... It's really you, Mom. Mom! Mom. You shouldn't have come. Why? Why would you do this? You've seen it on your way here, haven't you, Aya? All the atrocities this man's committed. I don't want any more victims of his. Don't you feel the same, Aya? You lie. If anyone understood father, it was you, Mom. It's Maria you don't like, right? You loved father, so you didn't like them to get along. I know how you feel. I love father too, so I felt like someone was taking him away. I was so scared, I couldn't breathe. <laughs> what a relief. You really are our daughter. So you do get it. Yes. It's all as you say. I couldn't stand to see your father and Maria together. So, you do still love father, don't you? Then why are you making him suffer? That's not what I want to make. Oh my goodness, chat. I... OBS, please. Internet, please. Network, please. Oh my goodness, not now. I am very frustrated how, like, it keeps interrupting at these, like, critical moments. I'm so sorry, chat. I don't know what's going on. It looks like there's some like jitter and like packet loss. There's a, actually there's a lot of packet loss. Oh my gosh, we're like sixty percent dropped frames. I'm so sorry. Are we back? What did we miss? Nothing. I have not moved on from here. The moment I saw the OBS drop down, we're back. A little bit of buffering. Okay, yeah. I'm currently looking at about sixty point five percent drop frames. I'm so sorry, Chad. We'll, be, we'll chill a little bit and see if we can, like, recover. Gotta go ahead and stretch while I wait. Tell us what happened. Nothing has... We haven't moved on. Um... Aya is trying to talk some sense into mom, and mom is saying that she's going to take father into the uh, into the afterlife to take care of him. Another big stretch. All right, one more big stretch. 
I think today just might not be our day. I'm staring at the... the OBS. Oh no, not at this point. See, now by this point, the, uh, the VOD is also... Like, we'd have to edit this part out. Okay, for those of us who are here, let's just vibe to... We can just vibe to, like, the, the music. <laughs> are we back? Oh, should, should I do that? Should I switch over to <laughs> make a Twitter space? And then I'll, like, recreate all the sounds. <laughs> Alright, we're back, we're back. Vibin, vibin, vibin. Welcome back. Nice, nice. Okay, I think we're good, I think we're good. We will proceed cautiously. But thank you, Ryan. Thank you so much for the super chat. Thank you, thank you. Really appreciate it. Alright. Let us try proceeding cautiously and optimistically. Here we go. Mom, take me with you too. Please. I can't possibly do that. I want you to live and be happy. But I can't. What makes me happy is being with you and father. So don't leave me alone. Ooh. No one shall interfere. Mom. Now, honey, let us go. Oh. Father. Ah, yeah. Oh, he looks so disheveled. Father. Oh. Father. Aya. Why won't you listen to your mother? Don't take father away. Out of my way. Mom. No one shall have him. Mom, stop. He is mine alone. Ah, Salty, thank you for the super chat. Thank you, thank you. What's this, mister? Magic water, a new product of a company. The power kept within the water shall no doubt be of help to you. I can save father with this. But what'll happen to mom if your love reaches her? I'm sure your mother can be saved. Really? I guess there's no being sure. What should I do? Oh, we should have saved before this. Okay. We're going to go back to the other one, the previous one. We will save father first. We'll save father first, and then afterwards we'll grant mom's wish. Right? We'll save father first. I'll say father. Oh, Aya, what are you doing? I'm sorry, mom. Stop, Aya. Ah. Ah. I'm fading. My body's disappearing. Mom. Ah, uh, yeah. Wait, don't go. Oh no. Aya's love couldn't reach her. We couldn't save her. Mm. Where am I? 
Father. Oog. Aya. Father. Aya. I'm sorry, Aya. I worried. Not again. Are you back? Oh. <laughs> ISP is going to get a stern talking to after today. We're back, we're back. Okay. I'm so sorry, Chad. All right, let's keep going. Let's keep going. Oh, yeah. I didn't want you to know the truth. But with the last of my power. Oh. Ooh. What? A fine sample. The cutscene from the beginning. It's the same dialogue. I shall dispose of the remaining materials myself. That can wait. Come, Maria. Doctor. Oh, doctor. The mistress is aware of our relationship. Mm, what does it matter? I don't believe she's fond of me. That is the problem. The girl will be 11 soon. A troublesome age, to be sure. Be kind to her, please. Ensure that she never comes to harm. She shall always be my most precious. All of them all. No. He never finished his sentence, did he? <sighs> Holy crap. Huh? A doll? Me? F father? Was that... Huh? This is... <sighs> now what? Mom! Oh. It's Mom's memory. How long is he going to stay cooped up in this basement? Don't tell me he's with that girl again. Doctor, Mistress Aya has become rather ladylike. And to think, she always used to make mischief and bother you. <laughs> Indeed. Just a little more, I think. A little more until she's ripe. Who the... Right, what? That is this... What the hell? I want to make her into the most beautiful doll I can. What? What's that? She shall be the masterpiece of all the dolls I've made. Are you kidding me? Not again. Not the drops. Not the frame drops. <sighs> We chill here. We just chill. I'm so sorry, Chad. It's like... It's like they know. It's like Susan knows. YouTube timing, right? It's like perfectly on, on, you know, on point, on the ball. Like, when it gets to the best parts, that's when, like, it, it goes down. Be back, be back. Okay, okay, good to see you. GLT, thank you so much for the super chat. Thank you, thank you. All right, we'll give it like a couple of seconds just for everyone to get caught up, to re uh, reconnect and all that. All right, yeah, we're almost done. We have all the gems. We're almost at the end. It's fine. We will, we will push and press forward, all right? We're going to finish this game today. <clears throat> Here we go. She shall be the masterpiece of all the dolls I've made. Dolls? What? Make her into a doll? Mom, what is this? 
I shall clean up the unnecessary materials. I won't allow it. You'll never make your precious daughter into one of your subjects. You. What's the meaning of this? Are you planning on experimenting on her? So you overheard. What are you thinking? She's her one and only treasure. Exactly. She's her wondrous daughter. I want to make her eternally so. And yet, she will someday be dirtied. That I cannot bear to think. So I will make her into a doll. I don't believe this. I'll never let you do that. I'm leaving. What are you saying? If you want a doll of her so badly, just make a replica. Wait. Are you planning on taking her away? That I cannot allow. Let's go. I won't let you do what you will with her. Mom! Oh. Uh. Uh. Mom! Milady, Milady, stay with us. Doctor, why did you do this? It had to be done for Aya's future. But, but, Milady, don't speak of this to Aya. But, she was already feeble. Say she passed away from a fit. Deceive the mistress. I see OBS crashing again. God darn it. Oh, oh my god. <laughs> I swear, there's someone out there watching me through a telescope, and they're like, oh my gosh, Shinri's gonna get to that point. Okay, okay, okay. Cut the feed right now. Cut it. And then, like, they'll, they'll flip the switch right when it gets good. Oh my god, I'm so sorry, Chad. I have no idea what's going on. Curse game, yeah. Maybe the network can't handle all these spooky games that we've been playing for a while now. <laughs> I think it's good. Okay, we'll give it a couple of seconds again just to wait for everyone to get caught up and reconnect. Like 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. All right, wait. I, I remember what um, Battle did. If you guys can hear me, or if we're back, if we're like up to speed, um, I'm gonna go ahead and say, type in the word dogs in chat. One, two, three, four, five, five seconds. Okay, about five seconds. I didn't have to go to 120 like Battle did last time. <laughs> okay, good. About five second delay. Not too bad, not too bad. All right, chat, let's keep going. <clears throat> Deceive the mistress. I... I can't. Are you refusing my order? No, that's not what... Maria. Whatever happens, I am loyal to you, doctor. That's why you are my assistant. <sighs> doctor. Now... How shall we dispose of the body? Naturally, I am must not see it. Mm. Mom, is this a dream? Am I just having a bad dream? It's no dream. This is reality. <gasps> Mom, I'm. Sorry, Aya. Uh, your mother still loves your father even now. So, I couldn't kill him. But I should have. Don't say that. Run away. Away from him. Aya? <gasps> uh, uh, Aya? Aya, what's...
What's wrong? Why do you look so afraid of your father? No. He took her body and stuffed it in there. No way. M mother? Aya. What I just saw was true? Father, you killed... Oh well, so much for that. Father... Well, Aya? Don't you think your mother's beautiful? <laughs> I suppose you can't just accept it yet. Yet, I know you will in time. I just want to wait a little bit longer, but... Father, you're gonna make me into a doll? Don't be sad, Aya. By making you a doll, your beauty can last forever. Look at these children. Beautiful, yes? Preserved, just as when they were alive. These are the fruits of the Dravis family research. None of them are moving. Is that what's gonna happen to me? Look at them from head to toe. You can only imagine their dolls, yes? But their heads, eyes, torsos, hands, legs, they were gathered from a wide array of people. I quite it, I find it quite fascinating. I even tried combining a dog with a human. What do you think? Incredible, isn't it? What would you like to be? I, uh... Alas, I can't make many changes while preserving your loveliness. Father, stop. Ah, and of course... I can dress you in all the finest clothes. Tell me whatever you wish to wear. Oh. Aya. Where are you going? Come. Be by your father. No. Oh. Don't tell me you hate me. Uh, sorry, father. But I... I don't want to be a doll. Oh, okay. Let's go and save. So this is the save that we made previously before we uh, made the decision to save mother or to save father. Yeah, the dog and the child. Yeah, we got that. A mannequin doll. Okay, I knowing the fact that they are like they were people, I, I won't be scared of you. You seem you seem fine. Gotta run. Proceed. Saving recommended. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. It won't open. Uh, yeah. Oh. Oh. Wait, he's helping. Open the door, Aya. The mannequin blocked it. Thank you. Oh, open. Oh my god. It's not giving me the prompt, so I don't know if it's working or not. Oh, oh. Oh my god, this is not opening. <laughs> oh. Time to run. Gotta run. <gasps> Ooh. Ooh. Avoid that. <gasps> keep running, keep running, keep running. Run. <gasps> Ooh. Hide, 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 hide. And then... Oh. Inside the barrels. Oh. 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 Oh.
Mann, 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 Mann. Oh, oh shoot. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Run away from the insane father. Oh my gosh. Uh, oh, oh jeez, oh jeez. Wait, wait. Get, we can get this. Mini chainsaw. Mini chainsaw. Mini chainsaw. Go, 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 go. <gasps> Ooh, it's out of power. Okay, that's fine. Mm. This is... Where's the doctor? Mistress. Maria. Don't let I escape. Oh. Wait. Gotta run, gotta run, gotta run, gotta run. Gotta run. Ooh. Ooh. I like the animation where you could, like, sneak by. Okay, save. Uh. Let's go save here, just in case. Ooh. Huh? No corpse here. Okay. Oh no, we can't break through this, not yet. What do I do? Where can I hide? We can pretend to be a corpse, right? I can hide here. Mistress, wherever could you be? She sees our bow. Where did Aya go? I apologize. I lost sight of her. You what? I, I'm terribly sorry. I, I'm certain she could not be far. Let us search elsewhere. You useless. Oh no, Maria. Oh no. Maria. Oh, doctor. Oh. Is there anything in here? Basement mortuary. Can we line with shady drugs? Ooh, doctor. Hmm. Line with shady drugs. Can we help her out anyway? Do I have any items? No items. Doctor. I, oh, I'm Father's still looking. Line with shady drugs. Why can't we pick up any of the drugs here? Any... Anything we can give to help? Ooh, bottles. I <gasps> gotta run. I gotta get it. Ooh. Uh, yeah. <gasps> Ooh. Okay, okay. <laughs> the house is way too big, uh, right? Yeah. yeah. He sounds really good, but he really does. Oh my god. Ooh. What? It's one of the dolls. Be one of us. That's enough of our game of tag, Aya. I have to keep you still, don't I? Let go. I didn't want to hurt you, Aya. It's a shame. No, stop, father. But I can cover your leg with this skirt easily enough, so it should be fine. I don't want this. I wanted to stay with you always. I love you, father. So please, please stop this. I, uh... Don't worry. 
Father and Naya will always be together now. So rest in peace. I love you. Your new dress looks wonderful on you. <gasps> oh no. Well, it's about time to sleep. Good night, Aya. Oh, bad end number two. Okay, we have to go back. We have to go back. All right, just before we switched. All right, we saved father. Now this time though, we save. We grant mother's wish. All right, so we've already read the dialogue, and for the sake of getting to the, the other ending, we're gonna skip through. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, let's go, let's go. Gotta go back. <laughs> this is storybook world. Better move on. Whoosh, 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 whoosh. And then we're just gonna skip through all the, uh, skip through all the dialogue here. <laughs> Mom, so you came with here, Mom, huh? Mom, you should have come. Why would you do this? You've seen it. More victims. You lie. Understood, Father. Don't like. Love, Father. I know how you feel. Love, Father. Couldn't breathe. Ha 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 ha. What a relief you are, daughter. <laughs> okay, we're gonna skip through all that. <laughs> no one shall interfere. Mom. Do, 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 do. All right, so we saved father the first time. Now what we're gonna do is grant mother's wish. All right, all right. I don't know if you can hear me like furiously clicking. Grr, roar, I'm angry. Have a new product. Buy one, get one free. Grant mom's wish. Here we go. I'm sorry, father. Mom, she loves you more than anyone. I can't take you away from mom. I, yeah. I'm sorry. Oh, this one has a graphic too. Where am I? Did I make it back? It's just me. Oh, there isn't a cutscene this time. Oh. That's a lot. Oh, that's a lot of. Wow, it's still going. That's a lot of blood. Bride doll. It has a lonesome look. Seems familiar. A stuffed something. <gasps> Why is it so fresh? I can't interact with it. It won't let me. It won't give me the option. Okay, we're going to ignore that. We know what that is. Aya doesn't. Not in the... Not in this timeline. Aya doesn't know what that is. Okay, we'll go save there. A mannequin doll. Hmm? <gasps> the 
There's no chase sequence in this one. Oh, Maria. Maria. <laughs> this is... Mistress. Where's the doctor? What happened to him? No. He... Doctor. Doctor. Oh. Okay, aside from the cheating thing, like, Maria must have cared a lot. It's so quiet. The curse must have faded. And father's gone. I'm sure this is for the best. Now, no one will be hurt by father's experiments anymore. You'd say the same thing too, right mom? But what do I do now? I don't have a father or mother. If I'm by myself, no, I shouldn't whine about it. I just have to live on my own from now on. Maria, you can go back home. Though, if you have nowhere to go, I suppose you can stay. Uh, Maria? <laughs> Do we just get... Doctor... You're no longer with us. But please... Take heart. I shall take on everything myself. The future you wished for the mistress. I shall see it out. So please... Rest in peace. No, Doctor, I love you. Oh, bad end one. Oh, one more time. Moikai, you need to go. Okay, we gotta go. One more time, we need to find the good ending now, right? We got two bad endings, now we need to end off with a good ending. Same thing, we're gonna skip ahead with all the data that we've seen. <laughs> yeah, all the endings. We got bad ending one and two, and now time for speed. I'm gonna go ahead and skip all the, uh, all the dialogue again. Whoosh, whoosh, whoosh. This is why you get chainsawed. Yeah, I think Maria needs to get chainsawed. Not in like a bad way, but in like a... We need her, that to happen for her to progress into the good ending part. <laughs> Sorry, chat. We're going to skip through all the dialogue to get to the good ending. Zoom, zoom. Oh, that's right. I think I may have saved at the point, but we're just going to have to just go and speed through it. <laughs> <laughs> there is a thing we need to interact with right before, I believe. Okay, so this happens. Can we just exit here? I can't exit out of the, the cutscene, can I? No. Okay. Save father, which is what we need to do. And then after we save father, we gotta wait for Maria to get hurt. Zoom, zoom, zoom. And then... Uh, I'm... Fady. I know... I, I remember a scene here where someone read that and goes, I'm fucking dying. Like, I, I remember someone, like, misread that. The dialogue. I just wanted to point that out. But otherwise, let's keep going. <laughs> the art's really pretty. Oh my god. Oh no. OK. 
okay, okay. Let's keep going though. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. So we're gonna skip all the um all of the dialogue here. We need to see the flashback, and then after we see the flashback, wait, can I just like skip? It won't let me go to the menu, Chad. I'm so sorry. The cutscene's really long. I don't know if you can hear my keys. Gentle keyboard ASMR. People are saying you have to check the question mark room to get the good ending. Ooh. Don't know if true. We'll check it. We'll see. Hmm. I'm censored. Oh no, so the, the actual text is I'm fading. Like I'm fading away, my spirit is fading away. That's what the actual text is. <laughs> All right, sorry, chat. We're gonna. This cutscene's very long. This is gonna take a while, chat. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Mom's stabbing speed on rain. Okay. Conversation, we go over there, we see the Iron Maiden. There's mom's body. Why is she not juicy in this one? Like in the previous one, there was a ton of blood, but in this one, there's no blood. I'm curious, I wonder why. Wasn't it already closed though? Oh, the father got dragged in there. That's right. Yeah. Okay, let's go save number five. Uh, number five. Okay. She took the dad with her. Ah, oh, see. I think this part is just like timed, so we have to wait. Wait for dad to like rev up the chainsaw and then stab the mannequin and then only then do we get the uh um prompt. There we go. Sorry, I had to pour out some more coffee. Ron Squeeze, thank you so much for the super chat. Thank you, thank you. Okay, now we can go. I'm sorry, bad kid, like, he was doing his best to, like, protect us, and in the meantime, I'm just, like, sipping on some coffee. Whoop. Whoop. Ooh. <gasps> and he just straight up jumps down. <laughs> Wait, has this entire run been deathless? We haven't died yet, have we? Ooh, yeah. I think we're I think we're gaming. <laughs> Don't jinx it. Not yet. Yeah. Let's go and save here on number ten. Can we go back? Gotta run. All right. Okay, I guess technically that one does count as a death. <laughs> if we count the cutscenes, okay, okay. But like, we haven't like died, died in the game, you know? <laughs> but fine, I guess we'll count the cutscenes technically, you know? <laughs> Alright, there we go. And then, Maria gets hurt, right? So we're going to skip the dialogue since we've seen this part over here. Can't go this way, so we have to go this way. Up here. And then... Lined with shady drugs. Oh, we still can't do that. We still can't... 
Ah. Uh, okay, so we have to load up an, uh, an older save. We still have to go back. Yeah, because when we talk to this, when we talk here, it should say bandages. But because we don't have bandages, we need to go back, which means load back here. You need to read Maria's diary. Where is Maria's diary? Oh, wait. It's this room, right? The one that we haven't gone into. How do we open this one? Can't use that. Mm. Oh, thank you for the super chat. Dude, this dude can get two ladies fighting over this film for everyone. <laughs> mm. Let's see... If that's where the... Hmm. Those bandages in the bucket? They should be on the shelf, if I remember correctly. Where would they be, though? Gotta find the key, but where's the key? Okay, chat. Since we're getting... Since it's already been pretty long... Um... Our chainsaw doesn't work. Uh, since it's been getting pretty long and we want to find a good ending, I will allow backseating now to get like to figure out where the key would be. In Dad's room? I don't think Dad's room, right? Hmm. I'm not sure. In the jail rooms. Oh, that's a while back. That's really far from here. Did you solve the solve this shuffling puzzle? Yeah, we did. <laughs> you didn't get Maria's key when she was fainted, did you? No, we did not. Do we have to go back and find her body? All right, let's go just check. Do, 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 do. Okay, head back in here. Maria should still be fainted. Ooh. Got a room key. Oh, her body is gone. We had to go back into the laboratory. Uh, the workshop, I mean. Nice. Easy peasy. All right. Let's go find out the story of... That person looked so sad. Go after the man with the sad eyes. Are you... The man with the sad eyes. Key to Maria's room. Huh. Darts? Ooh. Found a diary. Could this be Maria's diary? Let's find out. Extuary X. Doctor. It has been a year to the day since I've come to this mansion. I'll never forget that day. Oh, is that Maria? Please. Food. Oh, give me food. Somebody. I need food. Oh, a vagrant. She could be a fine subject with some work. It's pitiful to see one so haggard. Come to my home, please. I'll give you clothes and a delicious meal. <sighs> so this is what they meant. Mom was right. Literally picked her off the streets. But he says this to everyone. No wonder Maria cares so much about... him. Stay here for a while. I'll go tell my family about you. Family? Oh, she looked so different back then. I have a wife and a daughter turning seven. I'm sure they would welcome you. Family. He keeps telling all the people he picks up that they'll be family. Uh, was this person taken in like I was? awful injuries. He's in pain. 
Perhaps I could do something. <gasps> Wait, is she... Like, medically skilled? My skirt won't be enough cloth. The only other clean cloth I have is... Ah, <gasps> so that's why... Father trusts her. This is a surprise. Coming from the brink of death, he's made a significant recovery overnight. Seems he was given excellent treatment. Did you treat him? Yes. How handy. You're exceptionally talented. Please, I... It'd be awful to wait to let such talent go to waste. What's your name? Huh? Uh, I'm... I am... Maria. Maria, hmm? An appropriate name. Maria, would you be my assistant? I do not wish to lose you. Please, stay with me. <sighs> well, will you entrust me with the rest of your life? Yes. <sighs> so she had the talent and he didn't want that talent to go to waste, which is also why I was so happy. So happy you had saved me. I was alone, but you made me needed. You gave me love. As long as I am needed, I will stay with you. How would I live without you? I love you, Doctor. So this is why she felt so confident to be able to carry on his legacy and continue those um, procedures afterwards. She still had all that training. Mm. I never knew anything about Marie after all. Maria must love father too. Maria's room. It's labeled Maria's room now. Oh my gosh. All right. Now. Now we head over. We should save just in case though. All right. Same thing, chat. We're going to go ahead and skip all the cutscenes. Oh, no. We have to go through the very long cutscene, don't we? Oh, my gosh. I'm so sorry, chat. It's okay, though. We, we are almost done. We're going to find the good ending, I think. Whoosh, whoosh, whoosh. All right, and now I'm just gonna spam the keys. <laughs> ah, mm. Yeah, so we got both bad endings. Bad ending one, where um, mother took father away and killed them both. And then because she's alone, Maria decided that she's gonna take up father's uh, like business basically and then bad ending two where <laughs> and bad ending two where unfortunately um, father survived and we couldn't escape and then it ended up with Aya dying and being turned into a doll all right now we save father Right? Yeah, say father. I wonder if there's a difference if we have a friendship with Maria, but also grant mother's wish. Are there four endings? Oh, we get to see the really pretty art again. Oh, so pretty. Oh. All right, let's keep going. Let's keep going. Soon. It's almost done, Chad. <laughs> I'm so sorry. We're going to we're going to see this until the end, so we're just going to keep script, uh like sprinting through all the cutscenes.
I guess we should have like saved a little bit. Um, what was it? We should have like followed all the instructions, gotten the key first, and then saved, because that way most of the progress would have been done, and this kind of cutscene uh, wouldn't have taken so much time. What if you never jump into the portal? Oh, then you never progress because like the game requires you to be uh, in there in order to uh, continue the story. If you don't jump into the portal, what ends up happening is you just stop the game. There's no progress anymore. <laughs> it's really cool how there's such an international audience here. I'd love to hear that. Do, 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 do. And then... This is a dream. No, it is reality. And now we have to run. Oh, wait. Uh, first that, and now we run afterwards. <laughs> I'm going to be honest. I kind of find it fun to do voices for, like... The dad, the father, the crazy father, when he's like, when he's lost it. I think it's a lot of fun. I don't know why. Like, that specifically is like a really fun thing to do. <laughs> All right, now we save down here at the very bottom. Okay, and then proceed. And then we can just chill. Your voice suits him. Is it doesn't really. Do I really have that like evil, crazy, like father voice? <laughs> All right. We wait and then just wait for the, the, the cutscene to trigger. save her this time. <laughs> okay, now we can run. We don't need to save because we already kind of know what to do. Let's keep going. And then now we need to go lure him down to the side. Wait for it, wait for it. We're back. We're back. Oh, I think we're back. All right. <laughs> okay. Same thing. Um, since we just reconnected, let's see how far uh, out of sync we are. All right. Um, this time, I want people to say cats because I don't know. I don't. I don't know when people are typing in dogs. So cats. One, two, three. Okay. Four. Oh, only four seconds. Okay. Not too bad. I paused here, so we haven't made much progress. We just dodged the thing. Uh, dodged. Angry, angry dad. All right. Thanks for that. <laughs> Love to see all the cats. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Let's go. Let's keep running. We're going to skip this part of the dialogue and only stop for the ones that we have not read yet. Mistress. Zoom. Wait. Okay. Now we go through here. Lined with shady drugs. That should be fine. What do I do? Where can I hide? I could hide here. And now... Okay. 
Okay, we've seen this part before. And then... Maria gets attacked. Alright, now... Let's double check. Please, please, please. Ooh. Please, game. Please. Let me help Maria. Doctor. Maria. Ah, oh, there we go. What do I do? So much blood. Is there anything I could use? Mission. Help Maria. We can help her. It's not with shitty drugs. Is there anything here? Huh. Bandages. We can help Maria. Let's go. Good ending. Good ending. They should help stop the blood. Mistress. Thank you for caring for the likes of me. It's fine. Don't worry about it. I should be most loathsome in your eyes. Please. I... It's true. I've known how you feel, mistress. I took away someone beloved to you. Of course you would hate me. But you are very kind to show me such compassion. Maria. Maria, can you stand? Mistress? Let's get out of here. Together. Ah, <gasps> But, mistress. I'm the same as you, Maria. I thought I couldn't live without father. But the way father thinks of us... I don't want to be a doll, so I can't be with him anymore. But you and I, we both can't live alone. So, let's go together. Even if, the, even if father's gone, I know the two of us can make it. Mistress. I shall accompany you, mistress. Aww. Oof. Maria! Apologies, mistress, but could I have your shoulder? Okay. Alright, we save. Oh. <gasps> Father's still looking. Okay, not that way, this way. This is very cute. Protect. Mistress, hurry! Oh. Maria! Mistress, never mind me. Escape! No! We're leaving together. I can't go any further. You must escape alone, mistress. If I'm by myself, I... It is alright. I shall not leave you alone. I will follow behind for sure. Believe me. Please. Maria. I trust. <gasps> oh. Uh, yeah. Ooh. Uh, yeah. yeah, hello, rude. Let's go, let's go. Get out of here. <gasps> Not again. Come, be with us. <gasps> uh oh. That's enough of our game of tag, Aya. I have to keep you still, don't I? Let go. I didn't want to hurt you, Aya. It's a shame. No, stop, father. But I can cover your leg with the skirt easily enough, so it should be fine. I don't want this. I want to stay with you always. I love you, father. So please, please stop this. Aya. Don't worry. Father and I will always be together now. So rest in peace. 
I love you. Mistress? Maria? Are you hurt? Maria? Father isn't moving. Did father... die? I apologize, mistress. I had no other choice left to protect you. Oh, It's okay. This is for the best. Right, mom? Saving us. No need for thanks. I just did what she asked. I just did what she asked. <gasps> the youngster. Oh, I'm sorry, Chad. Olivia, you heard that but my stomach is really growling. The youngster that the old man was saying, listening to what she said, that was him? You mean my mom? Like I said, I'm sorry for scaring you. I had no intention of harming you. Believe that, at least. I understand. Mom was trying to protect me. Thank you, Mom. I want to see her again. She wanted that too. But I don't think she wanted... I don't think she wanted to be seen as she is now. That's... Whatever Mom looked like, I... It's alright. She's always watching you from afar. Don't be sad. If you are... It'll only make her sad. That's what she said to us. Okay. The curse will wear off soon, so it's almost farewell. You're going away? We're all alive now, only because of the curse. I see. But there's something I must do before I go. And that is to set fire to this mansion. Why would... You can't do that. All those happy memories I have here. This place simply can't be left intact. It's possible that someone could find it and continue your father's work. We can't let the same tragedy happen again. Is that what mom wanted too? Hmm. I see. If that's what she wanted, then do it. Mistress. It's okay, Maria. Even if the house is gone, the memories of father and mother won't go. Mistress. Yes, that's right. Aya, there's one thing I ask of you. Do not ever forget the people who were sacrificed here. None of us had any relatives. No one looked for us. No one remembered us. No one knew we existed at all. It's as if our very existences were erased from the world. We did indeed live. So I don't want you to forget that. I want you to hold proof in your heart that we were here. That's the least you can do for us. Yes, I'll never forget. Thank you. Well, this is goodbye. Already? Oh. Ah. Goodbye, Aya. May 
you be smiled upon. <gasps> it's the good luck charm. Now, go. Goodbye. It's very sweet. It's just the two of us now. Well, and Snowball. <laughs> yes, that's right. What shall we do now? I don't know. We have to find somewhere to live. But I'm sure I can't live alone. Maria, will you come with me? Yes, of course. You've done so much for me, mistress. Now it's time for me to help you. Whatever awaits ahead, I wish to protect you all the way. Thank you. Oh, Let's go. Are you sure? You won't watch it till the end? Yeah. It's fine. Father. Mother. Goodbye. Oh, naturally, I wonder where the guy with the black coat went. I kind of hope he's okay. I'm sure he'll be alright though. He's such a mysterious guy. Come on, Snowball. Eh? A book. Was that... Was that the book that father was re- Mistress? What is the matter? Mm, nothing. Let's go. The mistress is very hardy. Even after that harsh experience, she walks on without shedding a tear. With the mistress besides me, I feel like we can overcome anything. However... What is this uneasiness I feel? Doctor? <sighs> oh. Back at the burning. <gasps> it's Ogre, the salesman. Cubans are such utterly foolish creatures. I've seen countless many foolish humans, but you are the most foolish of them all. A human mad with desire is more fearsome than any demon. And yet, I adore such foolish humans. Come with me. If you come with me, you may research to your heart's content. He's still alive. He's still alive. I'm finally here. I've heard about this place. Dravis Clinic. Clinic? Yeah, this must be the place. It's out in the middle of nowhere. I bet no one even notices it. Um, hello. Ah, a patient. Welcome. Wait, is that Aya? Ah, look at the haircut. The new haircut. Aww. She's so pretty. Is she the doctor? What seems to be the problem? Yes, well, I was born rather feeble. I usually get checkups from my local doctor, but... How do I say this? Uh, my family doesn't have much money, so the doctor's given up on me. That's why I came here. I heard the doctor here does checkups for free. <gasps> oh, she runs a charity. Oh, that's really sweet. Yes, we don't ask any money for my patients. 
so don't worry. Oh, Really? I honestly don't have any, so... Can I really get examined? Of course. Th thank you. Thank you so much. What's your name? I'm Jean. Jean Rooney. Jean. That's a wonderful name. I'm Maya Javis. It's nice to meet you. Yes, you too. She must have taken like the knowledge, like the medical knowledge of her father, and she's now using it for good. <sighs> That's how you do it. You take you take the reputation and the 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 curse, right? And then you flip it. You use it for good. Ah. Uh, That doesn't sound good. We should examine you right away. Come in, come in. For someone who's got all that healthy, who's not all that healthy, your legs sure carried you a long way. Was it difficult for you? I met a kind woman on the way here who took me part of the way by coach. It was so nice of her. There are some really nice people out there. Just like you, Dr. Javis. <laughs> you think so? Well then, let's begin. Now, lie down here. Boy, I'm nervous. I hear horses. They don't sound far off. Are they in the back? Stand very still. Stay very still while I apply anesthesia. Ah, yes. You have very pretty eyes, you know? Oh, so beautiful. I'm almost getting lost in them. N no one said that to me before. Thank you very much. <laughs> Nervous, huh? It's fine. Just relax your shoulders. <sighs> She's blushing. Oh, look at that. Doctor. Um, doctor. Do you think you can make me better? Of course. From now on, you'll never suffer again. So don't worry. Now, go to sleep. Dean, the mistress is much like you. Oh, it does run in the family. Doctor. Oh. No. It does make, it does not make sense why you would need anesthesia for a quick checkup, would it? Oh. No. Oh my god. And it's a charity too, yeah. They take people who are poor and can't afford to pay a doctor because they would be the least likely to be missed, to be noticed when they vanish. Oh my god. Oh my god, Chad. The music is a bop though, like... This is the good ending. It does run the family. <laughs> oh, wow. That was good. Yo. Oh, man.
Yes. Oh my God. Oh my God. Playtime, three hours and a half. Mode normal. 20 out of 20 gems. Continues used, zero. Easy chat, no deaths. No deaths, look at that. Zero continues used. <laughs> ah, easy peasy. New illustration unlocked in the museum. Must have ble beaten the blood mode to change title image. Ooh. Blood mode unlocked. If mode unlocked. Ah, <gasps> yeah. Oh. That's right. We collected all the gems. My. You've made quite a mess here. Well. Have you grown used to this lab? Oh. <sighs> this girl. Is he making... Oh. You still long for your daughter. I see. I see. A matured form. Yes. Of course. She shall come into my world as well. <laughs> I look forward to her birth. I hope you can someday show the girl your home world. Oh my god. That... That's not okay. We're gonna keep... We'll always be together. My adorable Aya. Yeah, this whole family has issues. <laughs> oh, very big goodbye. Very big goodbye. All right, Chad. Okay, Chad. I'm sorry this takes so long, but we're going to have to go ahead and call it here. I don't think we have time to even uh, really discuss the lore, but we could talk about it later on. Um, but I do have to send you all off because it is pretty late. Blank, thank you so much for the super chat. All right, Chad. Uh, real quick, let me go ahead and swap over back to the... Just chatting screen. There we go, there we go. All right, Chad. Um, real quick, later today, um, during... Wait, why am I over here? C Rose, thank you so much for the super chat. Thank you, thank you. Do you plan on playing any more? If I get the uh, permissions to do so, I will. If I get the permissions. Um, but again, everyone, thank you so much for stopping around. Um, today, during our Zatsudan reading, I'll go ahead and read the super chats from today as well at the end of the Zatsudan. So we'll do another one of those one hour um, Zatsus and then uh, one hour of like super chat reading. I think I do need to go and like catch all the super chats from uh, playing Visage as well. So we'll cover all the super chats then. Um, so we can talk a bit more about it th at that time. But for now, I think I need to go and send you all off onto a redirect. Thank you so much for being patient with me as we went through all the uh, three of the endings, not all of them. Um, so we're going to go and send you off into a redirect to Phileon, who is currently playing more Hatful Boyfriend. But again, everyone, thank you so much for giving me some of your time, a couple of your hours. I hope you have a wonderful day. And I will see you all later tonight as we do another Zatsudan. But please, um, take care. And I guess, you know, enjoy the time you have with each other. And like, I guess take a look in the mirror and just check out how pretty your eyeballs are. Because you should be able to uh, admire them before, you know, someone, someone takes them. <laughs> All right, everyone. Goodbye. Thanks for stopping by. Koyasumi. Koyasumi.
thank you for the super chat, Mian. Uh, I think Fleon is already playing Angels of Death, so feel free to go check out his gameplay of it. He's got two VODs of it up already. But yes, thank you so much for the recommendation and thank you for the super chat. Again, I just want to thank everyone for being so patient. I know we had a lot of uh, disconnects and network issues earlier today. I will do my best to try to go get those fixed. Um, I really don't know what's causing them, um, but I'll go ahead and call my ISP, see if I can do like a proper reset of my router and all that. So hopefully we'll be able to continue the next streams without much issue. Um, let's see, what do we have tomorrow? I forget. It's been a I, not me forgetting my own schedule. <laughs> I think tomorrow we have a light-hearted game called What the Golf. Uh, it's a bit more of a silly golfing game, so nothing too scary or traumatic. So I'll see you all then. Koyasumi, Chad. Koyasumi.